Oh, what's up, chads? Uh, I'm not sure if we're live or not, but uh, timestamps should be in the top pin comment below. Once again, not sure if we're live or not, but timestamps always in the top pin comment below because we got a little bit of time to kill. We got about 29 minutes before the Ubisoft Forward live stream starts. And ladies and gentlemen, guess what? <laughs> it came in the mail yesterday. You know, like last time I was streaming the model or the Call of Duty 2020 reveal, it broke, dog. My my horn died, okay? And now. I finally got a new one, so we're gonna be having a lot of memes. Uh, we're gonna be playing that every time Ubisoft does an oopsie. But uh, what what's up? How you guys doing? Spirit, PP, Tim, Spirit, Nab, Juan, X Criminal, what's up? Ghost, Money Man, uh, Helicopter. Nah, 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 nah. Hopefully they are not doing helicopters, but they're really okay. I want the show to be good. And yeah, day fun. I saw that Battlefield Twitter got yanked though. Like Battlefield Twitter got yanked. Like. <laughs> I don't even know, man, how... I, I think that either somebody deleted, somebody pulled the plug, or it's like they are really getting ready for the next Battlefield. But that doesn't make sense, though. Because, like, Battlefield is next year. It's not this year. Uh, but we'll see. Crunchy, Burke, Thomas, not exclusive since. LT, Sky, Bloody, Okat, Okatsu, One, Sky, uh, <laughs> Sings, Harmony, Sings, The Magic, Bluder, Dylan, Cooley, uh, Holy... Sings, Wolf, Dylan, not the average, not exclusive, Juan, what's up, Bloody, Nabs, Spirit, Riley, Sings, Axel, Biljana, Cooley, Sings, Mr. Yo, Mr. Play, bro, what's up, yo, long time, man, how you doing, long time, man, you thought I'll forget about you, <laughs> absolutely not, man, how you doing, man, how you doing, hey, yo, what's up, Ivex, Derek, Crunchy, Leon, Andrew, Alejandro, what's up, man, yeah, dude, the horn is back. Like, yesterday it came in the mail, so, like, uh, I'm pretty happy. I, I think I'm gonna order one more, just in case this one dies too, because it took, like, almost three weeks before I got, uh, got a new one, because it came from China, you know what I mean? Uh, Han, what's up? David, how you doing? Gabe, that's uh, not the, the topic at hand, okay? We're not talking about that, okay? Like, we're not talking about that. By the way, how you guys feel about that Black Ops Cold War gameplay? Like, yesterday I was a little bit mixed, but I was still trying to, like, pick up the positives on this and that. Because, you know what, like, let's be honest, uh, you know, who wanna hear a dude complain, right? So, like, I was trying to pick up the positives, and right after that, right after I end ended the stream, I chilled out, I watched a lot of gameplay, and I gotta be honest, the, the weapons feel satisfying. Uh, yo, thank you for subscribing. So you guys like it? You guys like it? I personally think that I'm not mind blown, but I I do dig the the multiplayer gameplay though. You guys like it? Yeah or nay though? Yo, Basil, what's up, man? How you doing, man? What's up, bro? Casio, bro. Kh, what's up? Super sub mega stud muffin. Yo, what's up, my stud muffin? How you doing, man? How you doing, my stud muffin? It's not new enough. Uh, I don't know, it's different, but not new enough. I, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Like I am like I said, like I'm also not mind blown, but I like it. I like it, though. I think it's Call of Duty, right? So it's like another year, another Call of Duty. So it's like, yo, how can you expect me or anyone to be mind blown when we're getting this game every single year? So it's like, you know, if you think like that, of course. Like, I want to be mind blown. I want to get hit in the G-spot. Like, I want to I wanna get a shot of dopamine, too. But it's like... The game comes out every year, so I'm just hoping that we got good maps, good gameplay, the weapons feel satisfying, so there is that. Like, the hit feedback, the hit markers, dude, dude like, that, that that's satisfying. I'll say that much, though. And it's fast-paced, too, so that's uh, that's the positive out here. Hex, I see you, man. Thank you for subscribing, brother. Welcome on in. Elite, what's up? I'm good, yeah. I hope uh, you're doing good. Dude, I woke up recently, I was like, you know, you know what I mean? Like, I was feeling, and I did a little bit of squats just to kind of, like, wake up before I started this thing. It's crazy. Yo, Crazy Rabbit in the chat? Yo, Crazy, you there? GTA 6 2022 confirm. RXV, Justin, Blood, uh, Doctor, Hugo, what's up? Yo, thank you for subscribing, Ruben, what's up, man? But today we're getting Ubisoft. And recently, Ubisoft has been the new hotspot for doing Easter eggs, like, with Vamon and whatnot. Like, you know, every time, like... The CEO see like a women worker or a women dev a developer. They're like, okay, you sweetie, you wanna go do Easter eggs? Like, so that's has this is this has been Ubisoft recently. So I believe that their CEO came out and apologized. So that's pretty nice, man, because they are out there, you know, trying to ask for Bob's and Vagana picks this and that. So crazy. Ubisoft is a new hotspot. Let me tell you that. Your fight angel, what's up? I just woke up from a nap too. Yeah, man, it's just that's just the that's life on uh and that's life in a nutshell ryan what's up uh bro hello yo what's up sean boy how you doing or sean roy not boy yo sean how you feel about black ops cold war i heard that you were talking shit i heard that you were talking shit 
So I want to know how you feel about it. Yo, Sally, what's up? How you doing? Did you see the leaked Prince of Persia image? I have not. Uh, do you mean like the Amazon listing or like a gameplay screenshot? I've seen the Amazon listing, so I know that Prince of Persia is making a return though. So yeah, we're gonna uh, we're gonna find out today. And I'm not really a huge Prince of Persia fan, but I played in my early days. I played in the early days, so uh, yeah, man. If it's good, I'm gonna uh, probably cop it. So we'll see. Ubisoft is making a return, so uh, I don't feel hyped. To be honest. I was mixed yesterday, like, I was not mind-blown, still not mind-blown, but it's just like, you know, like, what else is out there, right? Like, there's nothing, like, the Ronis out there, I mean, it's kind of calming down, but at the same time, not really calming down. It's like, you know, like, school's starting up, so that's BS, like, it's, I don't know, man, like, there's nothing to do, right? So there's nothing to do, so it's like, you got your goals, you gotta, like, you know, if you got your goals, you're gonna strive towards that. But at the end of the day, you're gonna be like, okay, I'm lazy, I'm gonna fall asleep, this and that. Then you stop doing that. But, but, but you know, follow your passion, okay? Follow your passion. And then what else is out there? You know, what else is out there? You're probably gonna complain. You're probably gonna, like, you know, like, have a word with your parents. Uh, if you got your parents right, you're probably gonna complain with them. They're gonna complain. They're gonna ruin your day. And then it's like, you know, it's like a yin and a yang, right? Like, so what else is out there? Then it's like all about video games, right? So it's like... Call of Duty comes out every year, yeah, uh, looks nice, but not mind blown, so, you know what I mean, right? I, I'm not also, I'm also not mind blown, but it's looking pretty nice, though. What is this, Fortnite? I think this is, uh, what's this called? Uh, I forgot the game name, so it's, it's like Fortnite, but another one. Uh, it, sh this sh it should have a name right now, uh, Elite Squad. Oh, it's Tom Clancy, okay, I, I was thinking about some other, other thing. Yo, what's up, Exotica, how you doing? What's up, how you doing? Yo, what's up, uh, what's up, Zahar, how you doing? How you doing, girl? NYC, let's mu uh, much love. Alejandro, looking forward to Far Cry 6. Yeah, we're gonna have Far Cry 6. Anybody, any of you guys play uh, Hyperskip? I wanna know though. Zombies better hit in the G spot. I agree, but dude, I'm kinda sus about zombies, man. Like, I don't wanna offend anybody, okay? I'm raising my hands, I'm putting my hands up, and I'm putting them together. I really hope it's not like World War II zombies, cause like, I got erectile dysfunction. Like, I, I had a kick of PTSD. Massive, massive kick of PTSD yesterday. So yeah, we're gonna have Hyperskip today, Far Cry 6 they said, Assassin's Creed for sure, Watch Dogs they said surprise reveals. Uh, so I think there will be two surprise game reveals, one of them might be Prince of Persia because it got leaked out on Amazon. So I think Prince of Persia Remake, and one more, we'll see what that is. I finally noticed me senpai, now, now I got like a bigger chat, so I see a lot of you out there. I see all of you, but it's just that, you know, like sometimes I, the words do not come out of the mouth, okay? Uh, I like World War II zombies, I don't know why everyone hates it. I think, not the doctor, okay, so my thing is that I don't hate World War II zombies, I just do not find replay value in that, you know what I mean? Like, for the first time, it was pretty nice, man. Like, you know, zombies jump out, like, you got that uh, horror vibe, and it's like jump scares, what not, what, what not, but after a while, it gets repetitive and it gets a little bit boring, you know what I mean? Black Ops 3 zombies was not like that, man. And I think that Black Ops, the, the reason Black Ops 3 Zombies succeeded was because it had three years break, three years gap. Of course we had Advanced Warfare Zombies, but Black Ops 3 had a new engine and it was like the real uh, next-gen Call of Duty game at the time. It came out in 2015 for PS4, also had the master version on PS3. Yo, what's up, Jidiana, how you doing? Uh, and it really felt next-gen. I think that's what it was, like, it was fun, the gobble guns were fun as well, of course some people didn't like, but that's whatever. Uh, the easter eggs weren't too complicated, like, I would say, Black Ops 4. Yeah, Black Ops 3 was perfect. I mean, Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 3 Zombies was perfect. I'm hoping that this time it's uh, good too. You cannot really judge it because it's like 11 second clip that we've seen, if that makes sense. Love from Turkey. Hey, what's up, man? What time is it for you, man? The horn came back, by the way, boys. So uh, we're gonna be playing that during the Ubisoft reveal. Uh, Wu Tang, what's up, Wu Tang? How you doing? Yeah, World War Two zombies just was horrible and annoying, and the Easter eggs in World War Two sucked. After, yeah, after World War Two zombies, I never done any Easter eggs. Black Ops Four Easter eggs were kind of annoying too. Like Blood of the Dead, I tried it multiple times, but it's like you gotta like sh you gotta find the bird, and then you gotta like you know if you're playing solo, like I'm a solo player, it's just. Like, I mean, give me a break, man. Uh, the Rise on Drach, though. The Rise on Drach, and I will say, even Zetsubu no Shima Easter Egg was perfect. Uh, for a solo player. Excuse me, the horn. Yeah, dude, it came back, it came back. I know my, my horn died the other day, but... It came back in the mail yesterday. I'm Silence, what's up, how you doing? 
Yeah, if I missed if I missed any of you out there, like I wanna welcome all of you chats, you know what I mean? Yo, what's up, Jason? Did you play the nah man? I, I'm a little bit critical of Call of Duty, so that's probably why they did not invite me. They invited me for Modern Warfare, but not for this one though. I, I think it's because like I think I'm critical. Maybe they think I'm hating on it, but I don't, I don't hate on Call of Duty. Like, I love Call of Duty, right? But maybe they think I'm too critical, so that's why. They only want to invite out people who are, like, 100% positive, right? Like, that got nothing bad to say about the game. I'm like, dude, like, how are you going to improve your game, right? Like, you got to listen to feedback, man. Like, for example, I don't like the HUD for the Black Ops Cold War game. I could be like, you know what? Remove the compass in the multiplayer. Leave it in Warzone because for Warzone it makes sense, but for multiplayer, I mean, you know what I mean, right? Any of you relatable? Any of you feel me on that one? Or like, nah, man, it's because I disagree. Uh, is the Ubisoft stream still thing in 20 minutes? Yes, the pre show is starting in 20 minutes. We'll see what happens. And the actual stream is gonna be right after the pre show. So, yeah, in 20 minutes. Give me a shout out, please. Mix, shout out to you, my guy. The only bad map on Black Ops 3 is Revelations, in my opinion. The only, and also, it's not even that bad, but I know what you mean. Uh, the only times I've played Revelation was for the solo easter egg and the co-op easter egg. I don't find it fun to play that map. I know what you mean, because it's like remaster maps. But I wish that we didn't get more remaster maps in Black Ops 4. I wish we had new maps. But Revelation on its own, it's a good map, but it, get, it can get repetitive, though. Uh, I, I know what you mean. Oh my, what, what, Ryan? <laughs> Ryan, you come in as stud muffin. What's up, man? How you doing? How's the wife and the children? Welcome, welcome to the to the VIP lounges, my guy. You're the first sponsor or the member uh, of the day. Uh, you need two more, man. You gotta head to 60, man. We gotta head to 60. Thank you, my man. Hopefully you're doing good. Honestly, it's because of Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War is Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2.0 or DLC 7. It's not. Uh, I know what you mean, dude. I really, I know what you mean. Uh, but it's like I thought about it yesterday. It's like, dude. I got none to do. I got none to do except for like following, like doing YouTube, like doing other stuff outside of YouTube. And then it's like video games and then spending time with your parents, uh, your, uh, your, you know, like your sister, your, your friends, this and that, like your GF as well, this and that. Like there is nothing to do, man. There is nothing else to do outside of that. So it's like Call of Duty. I love Call of Duty comes out every year. So, I mean, I'm not mind blown, but but you guys know what I mean. There's nothing to do, so I'm a Call of Duty player, man. It's like, dude, i not mind blown, but it feels satisfying. I'll say that much. Probably going to get it and probably going to play it. That's uh, Hopefully that makes sense. I'm not sure if, uh, if it's relatable to you guys or not. That is true. I'm just really hoping zombies. Same, man. I'm kind of worried about zombies, Wu-Tang. I really am. Worried, but also hype, and also not worried, but also kind of worried. Yo, Planet Zane, Kasi Ogandu, how you doing? Me and Skizzle in the same boat, in the same boat, Drake is still DJ Khaled. Hello, in uh, are the are the recommended specs for Cold War out already? Uh, nah, not yet, not yet. It did. I hope they, they show off Xbox Series X gameplay today. The, the, the games that they're gonna show are gonna be PS5 and Xbox gameplay, hopefully. Hopefully not PC gameplay though, because I they love their PC gameplays a lot. $500 Xbox, yeah. $500, you think $500 is good price or not? I think it's good, I think it's good. Sony is probably gonna make PS5 v 498, so everybody buy them, man. $1 less, $1 less. Uh, the games are on both lol. Yep, a mode into Battlefield and I know, uh, I sure know Battlefield is going to be, uh, going to be the daddy over the call of duty i love both i love battlefield i love call of duty uh but battlefield 5 was poo poo though at least in my opinion uh you know don't get offended you know uh stay woke and smash a like button for me to be brave and uh, you know what Nah, that i don't want to show you guys that okay I'll, I'll wait it out i'll wait it out there's something i want to show you but later okay later 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 yo what's up mike how you doing i was waiting for you man but seriously mike do not spam, okay? Do not spam. You're like abusing my my rules, okay? Like the reason, like I got no rules for my chat, dog. So it's like you, like dog, like in other streams you're gonna get banned, but here you're not gonna get banned. So I'm just saying, like politely, I'm putting my hands together and politely asking you to not spam, okay? Uh, Cause uh, I allow free speech. Here. Yo, Miguel, thank you for the two paper. What's, what or three paper rather? What's up? Yo, thank you for the th uh, three paper, man. I'm on a lunch break. Xbox S is a waste. Nah, man, it's not a waste. It's uh, for the, the people that cannot afford it. It's uh, it's pretty good for them. It's pretty good for them, I would say. 
because the specs are real impressive uh, for it. Okay, okay, man, I might have to add slow mode here. Okay, you stud muffins, like, I swear to God. Dude, in other people's streams, you're gonna get banned, okay? You're gonna get banned, but here, I'm not gonna ban any of you, okay? Uh, smash the like button for me to be, uh, uh, be nice and not, <laughs> not do any of that. Uh, I was doing some Zoom meeting raids. But don't spam, guys. Don't spam, you know? Like, I wanna read everybody. Okay, if you spam, I might have to time you out, okay? Because, uh, you know, that's, uh, yeah, I'm gonna time you out, okay? You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna ban free speech here on my channel. Yes, this is, this is me right now, okay? This is, this is me right now. I'm gonna ban my free speech. I'm gonna, I'm gonna change up the rules right now, okay? Uh, Silo, did you see the new streak system in Cold War? Uh, I'm not, I'm not fully caught up on it. The... Have no fear, your future marine is here. Yo, what's up, Eric? How are you doing? Gonna keep America safe. By the way, I'm in Canada, so, so you know what? Gotta dab on him. Uh, first train. But yeah, keep the keep it safe, man. Nice to have you around, man. Always love having the Marines around. You expect big gameplay? Probably not. Dude, you guys are abusing it. You guys are abusing it, man. You guys are... It's like... Okay, I'm gonna I'm time you out, okay? I'm gonna time you out, you stud muffin. You'll be back in five minutes, but... Uh, I don't hate you, but it's just like... Do not spam, you know? Uh, you on Twitch? I do have a Twitch, Ryan, but I don't use it. I, I just love YouTube, man. Anchor Gaming Gandu, what's up, man? How you doing? Yeah, she do be looking like a snack, though. That'll, that'll say for sure. We got yoga pants out there. For the, yeah, man, I think they are catching up on it. They know that when, like, yeah, yoga, with yoga, yo, she looks like that, uh, that actress, though. Like, I forgot her name, though. But yeah, she looking like a snack, though. Looking like a snack. Get ready for the GTA 6. Yo, did you say spam? I nah, nah, what I mean, okay, listen, 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 I mean, if you're just gonna drop Fs here, I, okay, my guy, okay, I might have to add slow mode here, okay, I'm gonna test out with slow mode, okay, where's slow mode? Uh, yeah, I'm, I might have to add slow mode, man, but there is no option for slow mode, what the shit, bro? Okay, where is it? Slow mode, unlist, nah, don't wanna unlist, enable auto start, nah, enable DVR, I think, like, once you go live... Yeah, you gotta do that before, I think. Before starting the stream. Yo, yeah, guys, come on, guys. Uh, time out. Stop, chat. Stop. Don't, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Chat, stop. Stop. Stop doing that, guys. Stop spamming like that, man. You guys are abusing it, man. I don't have rules, so you guys are abusing it. Yo, thank you for the one paper, Enderlet. How you doing, my guy? What's up? Oh man, I should have added slow mode, man. What was I? What was I thinking? Yo, what's up? Uh, <clears throat> yo, dude, dude, there's no option for slow mode, man. I was just having a chat. You know what? Like, I'm not even gonna talk about it because, like, the thing is, when you talk about it, like, people do it. It's like reverse psychology. All right, guys. You know what? Spam, spam. Just you know, spam your tits off in the chat. I don't care, man. We're getting a uh, we're getting Ubisoft reveal in uh, 11 minutes, sir. She's 13 and... Nah, nah, she's not 13, dude. Yo, GR all, what's up, my stud muffin? How you doing? Yo, what's up, Dex? Dude, guys, stop. Just, uh, you know what? Spam Fs. Spam Fs. I don't even care. Just just do it, man. Just do it. But just understand that I wish this upon your soul, okay? I wish that the next time you go to the barber shop, I hope that the barber gives you this haircut that you're seeing on the stream. Or better than that, uh, I hope that you get a haircut like this, okay? Uh, if you get 3,000 likes, I'll, I might get this haircut, though, okay? Uh, just, uh, might, might get it, though, okay? I'll put it that way. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna wish upon, I'm gonna wish that upon your souls, guys. If you're spamming. Yo, Enderlet, thank you for the one paper. How you doing, my guy? And JR all, uh, JR Roll, thank you for the two paper. And yes, man, the, the horn came in the mail. Love from Wales, though. Love ya, too, my guy. And GTA 6 is gonna be trash. Yeah, everything is gonna be trash. Everything is gonna be trash for sure. For sure. I see how you how you doing, man. Are you getting Are you getting both consoles? I'm getting PS5 disc version, Xbox Series S, and an RDX 3070. I'm thinking about. Uh, but thank you for the five paper, dude. Why Why are you, dude? You could have become a member, man. Like become a member, dude. Become a member. That would be much better. But I appreciate the five. I hope the wife and children are good. Uh, I'm thinking about getting PS5 and RTX 3090. Like, I'm a prince of Saudi Arabia, man. I'm not. Like, my ba my bank account is gonna cry, but I need that for the YouTubes and the streams and uh, PC gameplays and PC masteries, so... And then I might get the Series S, but I won't even have money, so... I'm probably gonna get Series S uh, later, if I need it. So far, I don't need it, though. Oh, my man! My man joining the VIP lounges! What's up, Gerald? 
literally the 59th? Yo, we need one more, man. Just just one more. Just one more till we hit 60. But nine more minutes till the Ubisoft reveal. What's up, man? Welcome to the VIP lounges. Hopefully you wash your hands before <laughs> joining the, the, the VIP lounges, all right? Uh, can you shout out my my friend Arjun and Fahis? Yo, shout out to your friend Arjun and so, yo Dark Spot Patel. Ye gandu wala move hai man. Ye main saale chutiya pain de lode. Ye F kyun dabar hai saale? Kutte just stop, okay? Just <laughs> just stop. Uh, try slow mode. Yeah, I'm trying to do it. I don't know where. I don't know how to do it. I there was an option before I started the stream, but now there isn't any option. Yo, rookie. I'm a rookie. I'm a I'm a YouTube streamer rookie right out here. You know what I mean? But you know what? Like spam all you want. I don't care. I don't care. I I'm still gonna reach out. Uh, hey, I'm sick. Uh, hey, I'm sick today. It would make me feel better if you gave me a shout out. My name is Fassel from Delhi. Yo, shout out to you, my man. How you feeling? Just drink some. Drink water, my man. Drink water. And try to uh, cut the sugar. And let me tell you, you'll feel good. But it's gonna take like three days. It's gonna feel three days if you cut sugar completely. So yeah, drink a lot of water. Good hygiene. Good diet. Cut sugar, man. Cut sugar, okay? I'm gonna I'm put it that way. Smash the like button for the for good tips out here. Salman Khan Gandu? Nah, he's good, man. You, you know, next time, I hope that tomorrow I hear cut as well, Judge, of Atom Jao. Barbershop, Nike to Kanpe, okay? I hope you get that haircut. I hope that you got that haircut. Yo, Anchor, thank you for subscribing. What's up, my man? How you doing? C Sips 100, what's up? Welcome on in. If you guys are new, I do Call of Duty and gaming news, so guard me like and subscribe, Mardo. Salo, what's up? How you doing? Imagine. Dude. Time out. Time out. Uh, Deck, what's up? Uh, poop dealer? Skizzle likes poop dealer? Uh, what's. Dude, you're calling me a poop dealer? You was, yeah, dude. I hope that next time you get this haircut when you go to the barber shop. I'ma wish that upon your soul right now, man. A skizzle was uh, fapping yesterday when he went to piss and he was watching elephant clapping. Dude, how are you gonna expose me like that, bro? Why? Why? What did I do to deserve that Ex expose? Hey, yo, thank you for subscribing, Orlando and JRL. Appreciate the five paper. Hopefully, the wife and children are eating good. See ya, step. Thank you, my man. How was your morning, Skizzle? Dude, I literally woke up, so it's like I woke up and started streaming. Yo, what's up, Mark? Apparently was a, wasn't sub. Dude, hit that subscribe, man. What are you waiting for, bro? Hit that subscribe button. Garn me subscribe, Mardo. Burn the party like, Mardo, man. Stream starts and whenever we uh, we got pranked by Ubisoft Skiz. Now they're gonna do their they yeah the official stream is in one hour, but they're doing there there's a pre-show too. So the pre-show is in seven minutes and then. It's gonna follow up with the actual stream, so it's like in seven minutes though. It's gonna be. Hopefully they don't prank though. Yo, movie king, what's up? And we're gonna find out if this is a prank in seven minutes or not. But they're starting the stream in in seven minutes. I'll I'll put it that way. PS5 price, uh, 4.98. I think they're gonna cut Microsoft. They're gonna undercut Microsoft like that. Uh, one dollars less, you know. I'm from Pakistan, Sudhir. Where if you where are you from? Where all of you stud muffins are from, like, let me know in the chat right now. Look at that, man. Any of you guys in Assassin's Creed? Like, Valhalla doesn't hit me in the G-spot. Like, I'm not mind-blown or anything like that. It's so hard to be mind-blown, dog. The, the game is good, don't get me wrong, but it's like, yeah, we got little shiats running around. People petting their cats, which is adorable. But, like, other than that, like, I'm not hitting the G-spot, dog. Germany? USA? India? Uh, Bharat, you're not from India, you're from Bharat, man. Bharat bhai, what's up? How you doing? Is thank you for subscribing, what's up? Have slow mode in chat? Nah, it doesn't work like that. Does it? Okay, let me try that. Maybe it does. I might be... Okay, I typed it. Let's see what happens. But now nah, I can read the chat, it's fine, man. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna get better, you know? I wanna get better at reading chat as well. Philippines, what's up? Texas, I see you. UK, Mars? Yo, that's pretty good, man. Uh, how how's the weather in uh, how's the weather on Mars? I wanna know. Is it is it is it comfy? Is it chill? Or is it like uh San Francisco and LA right now? Like I wanna know man. Hindustan Pluto Texas low dopamine? It is low dopamine, I'll say that. It is low dopamine, pretty much low dopamine. That's the that's and people ask like what's that? It's pretty much like Assassin's Creed, but low dopamine. Yo, Mark, appreciate subscribing. ZZ, ZZ, joining the stud, mu stud muffin lounges. What's up? Welcome to the VIP lounges. What's up? How you doing? How's the wife and the children? 
I'm not even sure if you're like a male or a woman, but if you're a woman, I want to ask you like, how's the husband and the children? Denver, Texas, Nigeria, yo, two back to back. What? You're joining the VIP lounges, Josh? Josh Boone, dude. Yeah, thank you all, man. You guys are being nice today, man. I yesterday you guys were nice, but not this nice though. It seems like that. Yeah, you guys are being nice today. I, I, I can't, I'm catching your guys' drift. Yo, Simon, thank you for subscribing. I love, I live in, on Saturn. Yeah, you guys are being way too nice, man. Don't have a wife or kids, but uh, do, dogos, you got two, uh, you do have dogos. What's, uh, how many dogos you got? So you're an animal lover? By the way, guys, if you could have one pet, which, what pet would you have? Cat or dog? Or, or tiger? I know that people like to have tigers too, man. That's just wild. You know, Mike Tyson. Yo, Mike Tyson's making a return, though. I'm kind of hyped for that. God of War ripoff. Yo, God of War was a masterpiece. PBH. But yeah, uh, Assassin's Creed is good, but of course I'm not. It's low dopamine for me, man. I don't know. Fishing's nice. No, all of that is high dopamine for me, but uh, otherwise, uh, I don't know, man. It's kind of low dopamine. Dog? I'm a cat person, man. Any any cat person out there? Yeah, I might get a tiger, man. One day I'll probably p get a tiger. Probably, <laughs> probably get a tiger. I'm watching from North Korea. Hey, what's up? How you doing, man? How you doing? It's like, so can you start uh, banning spammers, please? Because it's like this every stream you do. Dude, the thing is that I don't want to, I don't want to ban anybody, dude. Like, I don't want to ban. Like, I don't want to, but if people are mean to, let's say, anybody in the chat. Like, if you're mean to me, like, I don't care. But, like, if, if somebody is mean to other people in the chat and they're, like, self-promoting, then I'll ban them. But otherwise, I don't ban anybody. Because, like, it, it's just opinions, right? But, uh, I'll, uh. Uh, next time I'll have slow mode on. Next time I'll have slow mode on. Uh, slow mode on. It's like I need that. I need that right now. Uh, I don't know. There isn't any option. I cannot put slow mode on right now. So yeah, you guys. I mean, enjoy it while it lasts. You know, shit. Just do it. Spam all you. Uh, spam your tits off. I don't care. But next time, next up, watch out. Next time, watch out. All right. I'm a. I'm a. I'm gonna have slow mode on and I'm gonna cut all of your guys' wings. All right. Skizzle gonna eat. Gonna pet Glizzy. Yo, what's a Glizzy? What's a Glizzy? I'm watching from the sun, homie. Hey, good shit, man. Good shit. Good shit. Can you speak English? Nah, I, I speak bullshit, man. That's the language I speak. My man coming in with three. My man coming in with two papers. Four. Yo, dude, dude, chill. Time out, man. You're dropping so much paper, man. Got class, by skizzle. Yo, have fun, man. <laughs> have fun with your class, man. That's a low dopamine stuff. But hey, man, appreciate you stopping by. Nice, uh, li I, I love, I love you in the VIP lounges. Hopefully you came in today in the stream by washing your hands, because I definitely do not want you spreading the Roni and whatnot. Uh, but have fun, my man. Catch you in the next one. Start speaking a random language. Uh, random language. Random language. What, what language do I? I can speak five languages. So, guess pass my guy. To be je parle français. Burgers or tacos? I would say tacos. Tacos. Uh, Skittle paid by Activision confirmed. Yeah, confirmed. Uh, Call of Duty 2021 prediction. Uh, Modern Warfare 2. 2. That's probably what we're gonna get. I'm watching from your mom's house. Yo, that's Mr. Bobman's tw uh, 221's location out there. Uh, Ger Gerald says that what province you into? I'm in Quebec. I'm in Quebec. Uh, Canada. Quebec. Where are you at? You're in Canada, my guy? My G? Richard dropping two paper as well? You guys are being nice. What, what, like, what did I change today? Like, I didn't change anything. Like, the only thing I got is the, my horn back. I got my horn back. So is it, that is that the reason why you guys are this nice today? I didn't wash, wash my hands and got, <laughs> dude, guys. Okay, chat, watch out, watch out. We have a personnel with the disease. Okay, he's gonna spread the disease. He's gonna spread the disease. Okay, yo, I'm gonna go wash my hands after this stream. I don't want to touch my nose or mouth or anything like that. Call of Duty 2021 Advanced Warfare. Can you speak Zimbabwe? Yo, ma manual? Dude, for real manual? You're gonna drop 20 like that? Sony Pony Gang? Yo, same here, but... Yo, 20. My man coming in with an Andrew Jackson. Dude. Why? Why are you guys this nice? Why are you guys being this nice? Yo, thank you for the 20, man. Cold War looks awesome. Uh, it does look awesome. It does look awesome. I like it too. Yo, thank you for the 20, man. Love ya, man. Like, my man coming out of nowhere and dropping a Alexander Hamilton like that. Or Andrew Jackson, rather. Alright, let me stop the, the countdown here. 
And I'm gonna put the actual stream. You appreciate subscribing. Thank you all, man. You guys are a bunch of G's, man. Bunch of babes. All right, let me actually get there. All right, let's put you there. All right, let me actually pop you. All right, let's see if they're alive or not. The battle. Uh, they are, oh, they're alive. Chris, I was actually the first one knocked out, uh, but doing great otherwise. Okay, <laughs> yeah, that's all. That's a pre-show. Oh, that's a pre-show. That's a pre-show. <laughs> well, that's a pre -show. Here, yeah, hold on. It looks like you came out on top there, bud. Nicely done. Uh, yeah, guys, may may uh, just won that one. there's a pre-show. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's gonna be low. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You know what? Let me actually pop the pre-show here. Gonna be a little bit low dopamine, but uh, yeah, the pre-show, pre-show here. Uh, but you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep you all, uh, uh, all, all of you stud muffins entertained. Okay. Let me actually put that. Let me pop you. Yeah, they're live. They're live. But I'm gonna lower the volume down because it's a pre-show here. Yo, they're doing jack shit. Okay. Let me actually pop some gameplay here so you guys are, you guys are stimulated and whatnot. All right. Let me pop you. All right, I, okay. Uh, sorry about the dark screen, boys. Yeah, uh, so we gotta wait a little bit. We gotta wait a little bit. My bad, guys. We gotta wait a little bit. The pre-show might be low dopamine, so gotta wait a little bit. Yes, because how's the wife and kids? Uh, they're pretty good, man. I know you cannot see Christopher, but now you can see. Now you can see. Now it should be fine. Now it should be fine. Hold, thank you for the two paper. How you doing? What's up? The fire is nearing our house. Yo, where are you at? Uh, I know... Okay, so where... I'm not fully caught up with the wildfires or anything, but like, where did it start? Did it start in LA or what? Cold War doesn't look bad, idiot. Uh, dude, Mike, Mike is kind of trolling. Yo, Mike, I would have to time you out. And John, okay. Uh, any mods there? <laughs> Yo, mods, where you at? Where are you guys at? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. All right, put you there, guys. Stop spamming F. Excuse me, Poodler. Uh, PS5 and Call of Duty. I'm set. He probably lives in Cali. Yeah, it's in Cali, but where exactly in Cali? Oh, okay, Judiana, I know you're in LA. My car is covered in ash. But okay, your car so so in LA it's like it's crazy. So it's crazy in LA, right? Because I know I know that people have dropped pictures uh while living in San Francisco and it's wild in San Francisco. What's a good gaming PC? I would say get a Ryzen 3900X and then like try to get RTX 3070 at least and have like at least 16 gigabytes of DDR4 RAM, good motherboard. And that's it. Maybe have some, yeah, 750 watts uh, power supply. And that's, you're fine, dude. You're killing it with that setup, though. You're killing it with that setup. Far Cry, uh, this is old gameplay, like the stream. They're, this is pre-show, so. Uh, yeah, they're starting very soon, though. Starting very soon. This is pre-show, so we gotta wait a little bit. PS5 Gush. We're gonna have new gameplay today. Hopefully. Hopefully. Get my man dropping five paper. Supreme, appreciate the five paper. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a band mic, man. I'm a band mic here. <coughs> no, only gonna time you out, though. Uh, Mike, you know I love you, but, like, like I've been saying this for a while, dude. Like, you can say that you don't, don't, like, it's fine if you don't like something, but, like, you don't wanna, you don't have to spam like that, man. Uh, so much, uh, no, this is not a loop, not a loop. We're just, uh, my stream is not a loop, but the gameplay is a loop. Because I'm playing it just before the the stream starts because like i want to have something playing in the background rather than just my face cam right if that makes sense uh but the actual ubisoft stream is very soon though so they are having a pre-show they're talking and whatnot uh are you giveaway uh do you mean do i do giveaways uh, no i don't do giveaways uh, like if i have money i'll <laughs> when, when i have money I'll, I'll do the giveaways for you my man comments s is gonna have for ps5 how old are you i'm 24 man how old, are, how old is you my guy I, I was honestly very, very underwhelming by the Black Ops. Uh, to be honest, Alien, I'm also not mind blown, but it does look good though. Can I come to your house? Anytime. 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 But if you come here, like, you would have to get this haircut though, okay? Like, I'll put it like that. If you're, if you're a female, like, you gotta get like a haircut like that. You know what I mean? But if you're a male though, if you're a male, you gotta, you gotta have this haircut, okay? <laughs> you gotta have this haircut. This is your pass. This is your pass to enter, okay? That's that's all I want. That's all I want, all right? That's all I want. Uh, smash the like button for me to be brave and actually share uh, some expertise. Yo, what's up, Jordan? How you doing? If you get, How many likes we're at? Like, I just realized we're live streaming. I forgot. If you guys haven't already, hey, hit like, hit subscribe. I do Call of Duty, all the gaming news. I'm going to be doing those PS5 and Xbox live streams in the coming weeks because we're going to have them. So I got you covered. Definitely turn those notifications on and your name will pop on them streams. And with that, we're wrapping up uh, sub bro skizzle, keep up the good work. Daniel, I'm doing good. What about you? 
I'm kind of offended at these comments on Cold War, just give it a chance. Uh, Leafless, to be honest, here's how I view it, right? It's opinions. It's every, like, my opinion is not a fact, your opinion is not a fact, people's opinion in the chat are not facts. For sure, subjectively speaking, we can have, uh, we all got preferences, so we can all have things that we like and we don't like, right? And some people like Mike here, Mike is probably listening. Yo, what's up, Mike? He's probably listening, he's just joking around and whatnot. Uh, so... Yeah, some people, it's like, if you like it, don't don't be influenced by other people's opinion. I know it's easy to say that, but, like, seriously, don't be influenced by anyone's opinion. Uh, Ross, not a loop. Uh, I'm, I'm live, like, I'm reading your chat, right? I'm reading your comments, so not a loop. Uh, but I'm gonna time you out because you're spamming a lot. Literally all over California. Uh, when you think Sony is gonna announce price and dates, there is rumor, there's a rumor going around, I have not really checked, I haven't read too much into it, but rumors saying that October 1st is going to be uh, the pre-order, so that's a little bit late, that's late. September 22nd is for the Xbox. Far Cry sucks, nah, Far Cry is pretty good. The Cold War dev said that the gameplay you saw, the YouTubers played three patches behind, it's an alpha. It's gonna be odd. It's gonna be odd. It's nothing mind blowing, but it's gonna be odd though. It's gonna be odd. Uh, breaking the, is the new Call of Duty weapon inspection and finishing. Move. Yeah, uh, the executions and weapon inspections are coming back. You're going to get the new Far Cry, uh, most likely, because so far from the CGI it looks good, but gotta see the gameplay, man. If the gameplay is kutta, if the gameplay is like like Chutia, like Ubisoft, then probably not gonna get it. But I gotta wait till the gameplay, my guy. Gotta wait till the gameplay. You're not taking my shit. Gay station, ga uh, Gandu box. Okay, guys, let's actually settle this. Let's settle this. Gandu box or Gandu station? W what console you're gonna get? You're gonna buy the PS5 or release uh, on release or wait a bit. Uh, now I'm buying the PS5 on release. I'm just hoping that it doesn't come out on November 13th. I'm hoping that it comes out on November 12th or 10th, just like Series X, because like. On November 13th, we're also getting Cold War, so I want to be streaming that game, and I want to be streaming that game on, uh, by, uh, on, from PS5, so, like, I don't want to, like, run outside, get a PS5, and also I do not want to order online, because, like, if I order online, it's, uh, gonna come later in the day, it's not gonna come early, early, if that makes sense, I don't want to be, like, getting that super early in the morning, so I can, like, make videos and whatnot. But if I was a normal, if I was a casual gamer, I, I would just get Series S or upgrade my PC. If I was a hardcore gamer, I would probably upgrade the PC though, which I'm gonna do that. Uh, uh no, I'm Pakistani. Uh, Aditya, but what's up, Castle man? Welcome on in. I get Gandu Station. I want PS5 in October. Yo, Wyatt, what's up? How you doing? Xbox got no games? No, they do got a lot of games. They do have a lot of games. But let's not let's not fight like that, okay? Obviously, we need console fighters. We need console fighters in the front lines. But, because without them, 2020 will feel lame, like, let's be honest. A PS5 would upgrade it, 30-70 PC. I would say, if you don't care for the exclusives that PS5 gotta offer, then 30-70, 100%. 30-70, yo, Manuel, becoming a member, yo, okay. Uh, Mike, I would have to ban you for this stream, I'm gonna unban you next stream, alright? Uh, just for now, like, okay, I, I hit you up with a ban there, alright? Uh, I don't ban anybody, but like, like I told you multiple times, like <laughs> you have been doing that multiple streams, so uh, I'll unban you next stream, alright? But because you're spamming a lot, dude. You can say if you don't like something, dude, that's allowed. You can say that you don't like something. You, you even you can say you don't like everything as well. But like you're spamming, you're kind of just saying that, so uh, that's why I'm gonna I have to, my guy. Your manual, welcome to the VIP lounge. What's up? How you doing? You're the literally the 60. You guys are being way too nice, except for the Mike, dude, man. Mike, I love you, and you're gonna be back, but for now, I gotta, like, send you to YouTube Heaven, okay? I gotta send your YouTube uh, user account to YouTube Heaven. Nah, man, that's dirty. I'm gonna unban you, okay? Uh, but if you do that again, I'm, I'm gonna give you this warning, okay? Like, I don't wanna ban anybody, dog. Like, that's not me, man. You know what I mean? Okay, I'm gonna unban you, Mike. Mike, if you're listening, I unban you, alright? But if you spam again, then I will do it. This is like your warning, right? So, uh, you can say that you don't like, okay? You can say it, but don't spam it. Don't spam it, okay? Uh, Mike has been a bad boy. He has been a very bad boy. Shout out to my YouTube name if you want me to become your member. Uh, Frank Woods, I got you. Alright, let's see if you're a man of your man of your word or not. Yeah, hashtag free Mike. Lads, I'm back. <laughs> Yo, Mike, you know I love you, but, like, you gotta chill, man. You gotta, you gotta chill, okay? For you. I play this for you, okay? I play this for you, okay? Please, uh, do not uh, disappoint me, my man. 
Uh, Santa took him. Uh, dude, it's like, I don't want to ban anybody, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to ban anybody. PS5 is a weak-ass joke. Now, PS5 is good. Xbox good, too. Specs-wise. Xbox got a bigger schlong in GPU, but PS5 got the SSD. So, you gotta, you gotta keep that in mind, my guy. Uh, and, uh, we're, we're still waiting for the Ubisoft livestream. If you're just coming on, we're just, uh, we're waiting for it. It's very soon, okay? So, stick around for that one. I'm just playing gameplay, the old gameplay in the background, because we're waiting for it. So it's happening very soon. Get ready for that. I heard Cold War is a PS5 launch title. Uh, it is. It is. We're hearing that it's gonna release on November 13th, though. Like, I'm hoping that PS5 releases, like, before Cold War. Or at least, like, a week after, because I don't wanna... You know what I mean? Like, I don't wanna run outside, get a PS5, and make... Because I wanna be making videos. Like, for... for Because I'm doing YouTube, right? Hopefully that makes sense. Like, I wanna be streaming uh, the Black Ops game on day one. I hope PS5 comes out on the on November 10, just like Series X. That would be much better, wouldn't you guys say? Uh, make a schizole is a crook. Okay, I mean, if you're gonna give me that rank, I'll take it gladly with open arms. One hour to go. Assassin's Creed more like a yaking, a Viking Creed. Make Mike meme. Uh, yeah, Mike. Mike, do you like this haircut? Like, I wanna know, man. I wanna know your expertise. Rate this haircut on a skate scale from one to ten. I don't know. I would say this haircut, yeah, so 10 out of 10. Really using, like, here, here you guys go. I'll give it 10 out of 10. How much would you guys, how much would you guys rate it? Make my meme. I'll buy us both a PS5 and a Lambo to cry in. Any of you guys cry in Lambo? Any of you guys got Lambos and shit? Activision, Activision, they cry in Lambos, man. It's kind of, it's a sight to see. Yeah, they didn't know what I look, man. You're crazy, man. That's that's so much. <laughs> that's so much. Man. Don't even believe it. Cannot even believe it. He did that. I guess you don't understand velocity architecture. Did at a IO multiplayer again? No. Um, I guess uh, you don't. Okay. Uh, same comment. When is the live stream? It is. Uh, they had the pre-show going. So right after the pre-show ends. Cold word. Nintendo Switch, when is the PS5 pre-order? Uh, I think the actual stream, yeah, 12 p.m. Pacific, 12 p.m. Pacific. I cry in a spaceship, spaceship. Are they gonna show us Far Cry 6? They said they will, they said they will. I mean, their description says Far Cry. But they have not, like, tweeted about that. Are you Russian? Nah, man, I just love Russian. Ban me, I dare you. Uh, I'll time you out, okay? I'm like, I can, I don't want to ban anybody, you know? I'm not, like, just because I'm nice like that. But I'll, I'll time you out, Ross. You will be back in five minutes. Uh, when do you think, you know, just because you asked for it, though. Uh, ban, ban Rose, please. Matthew likes trash. When can we pre-order the PS5? I think we're gonna be able to pre-order in about a week or two. You can pre, you can pre-order that gold edition now for the PS5. But I think it ran out. We only had 250 of them. Guys, do I qualify to be a channel meme? Uh, yes, you do, Mike. Yes, you do. But do not spam. Don't, Mike. I'm keeping an eye out on you. Okay, okay. I'm keeping an eye out you on you, guys. I want, I want the snitchers. Where are my snitchers? If you're a snitch, come forward. Okay, drop a one if you're a snitch, because I, I want to like give you this job. If you see Mike spamming, you gotta snitch. You gotta snitch it to me. Okay, you gotta snitch it to me. You wanna spam? You wanna spam? And you gotta let me know though, uh, so I can like. Uh, hit my man up with a band hammer, man. Yo, Luke, what's up? How you doing? Armes, what's up? Sheikh, what's up? On the PlayStation live stream, will there be God of War 5? That's a leak. That's the word on the street from the homie, Moore's Law. I'm hoping it's true. Real hoping I'm, uh, it's true. I'm a snitch. I'm a snitch. Yo, officer. These guys, I swear, man, like, all the snitch, okay, you know what? I hope that one day, when you get go to the barbershop, you, instead of, like, getting this haircut, you get, like, this haircut, okay? Like, seriously, man, I don't like snitchers. I don't, <laughs> I don't like snitchers, man. Uh, I just gangbanged all of you guys, man. But now, seriously, for Mike, though, I want you guys to snitch, okay? If Mike's kind of, if Mike starts to wild, wild out, oh, we got two of them. We have these... Yeah, why, dude? Dude, that's a bug. That's a bug, probably. Yeah. But yeah, if Mike starts to snitch, or if Mike starts to cap and spam, I want you guys to snitch. I want you guys to snitch. What reveals do we have uh, for the P of PS5? So far, uh, Spider-Man. What? What else? Ratchet and Clank. 
There were two other... Uh, Gran Turismo, yeah. Spider-Man, Roger Glass. Uh, th these are the only games that I'm interested in, though. Otherwise, I don't know. I don't know, uh, to be honest. For Xbox, the only game that I was interested in was State of Decay 3. And they got Halo 2, but got delayed. Uh, what's your favorite game, bro? I would say favorite has to be GTA and Call of Duty. Literally, like, that's all I play. GTA, Call of Duty, Battlefield. But as of late, I've been playing a lot of story games. As of late, I've been playing a lot of story games. He spammed? No, I don't believe you guys. I don't believe you guys. I don't believe you guys. When is the event? When is the event? Uh, 12 p.m. Pacific. 12 p.m. Pacific. He spammed. Now I don't think I don't see him spamming. Oh shit! Okay, so we got. Okay, I, do I believe the snitchers? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. He spammed, but only three times though. Hey, good thank you for subscribing, dude. In other people's stream, you'll get banned. <laughs> you'll get banned. But I just, uh, I don't know, man. Guys, just be a homie, man. Don't spam. Be a homie. Don't spam. You know, let's have. We're we're chilling. You know, we're just chilling before Ubisoft goes live. I wanna read chat. Ha do you know any other YouTuber that reads chat? Like, tell me one guy. I mean, there. I, I know Crazy Rabbit. He reads his chat a lot. I love Crazy Rabbit. But I don't know any other streamer that reads chat. Have you played Days Gone? Uh, I haven't. Have you though? PS Gang, love you, bye. I love you too, man. Uh, Movie King? Yeah, Cap. I mean, Cap. Yeah, 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 yeah. But like, you're an exception, okay? You're an exception. I, I love you too, Abdul. Uh, Movie King, I'll hit you up with a, with a mod, because I've been seeing you a lot. Uh, mo uh, Movie King, you're a mod now, but do not time out people, okay? Do not uh, do not ban anybody, only time out people that spam like crazy. You know, if you see like five, six comments of somebody saying drop in Fs, then time them out. But like, uh, otherwise don't time out any, or otherwise do not like ban or time out anyone, okay? Don't do it, man. Everybody homie, okay? These are all chads. Some of them are not chads, but, but you know what I mean, so. Uh, stay woke, do not time out any innocent person, okay? Like, you see Prototype? I don't want you to ban him or time him out, but like, you can do whatever you want, okay? Now you have the powers. Now you possess the power of uh, the, this man, this man right here. You can do whatever you want, but but not whatever you want, but but you know what I mean, right? Don't do whatever you want, but. Uh, Lil, what's up? And if you're just coming on, uh, Ubisoft pre-show is live, but uh, we're still waiting for the stream, the actual stream. So we're just waiting for it. 12 p.m. Pacific, that's when it's going to start. So chill out. Get something to eat. Burn me like, Mardu. Garn me subscribe, Mardu, and all that good shit. If you're new, I want to know how many of you guys are new here. If you're an OG, say uh, OG. If you're old, say new if you're new. I want to know how many of you guys are new. If you're new, I do Call of Duty, gaming news, PS5, Xbox, literally everything. So if you're new, subscribe, your name will pop up on them streams, though. All right, like, let me put it that way. Your favorite Bollywood actor and actress? Uh, I would say Shah Rukh Khan, Salman as well, Akshay. I like him. In, uh, in terms of Hollywood, uh, Tom Cruise, 100%. Yeah, Tom Cruise, and I love that uh, Batman actor as well. Excuse me, touch. Yeah, officer, this guy yeah, so, trying to start rumors. Why am I not allowed to be a mod? This is a disgrace, dude. If I give you, if I give you a mod, that's game over, man. That's game over. This would be me. This would be me after that. Okay. This would be. This would be. Or actually, not. You know what? Let me actually pop like a relevant meme. Okay, where's our relevant meme here? Where, uh, okay, where's my folder, dude? I got so many folders here. This would be me. The, this would be if I give you a mod this would be me okay if I give you a mod so that's why I don't wanna I don't wanna and also this would be me too so yeah OG OG what is your favorite video game I would say GTA uh oh, nah Black Ops 2 Black Ops 2 I'll go with Black Ops 2 I know life Black Ops 2 yeah Black Ops 2 I'll say Black Ops 2 on the lookout for Mikey yeah, always like keeping. If he spans, you gotta snitch, okay? Crab rave? Can I get banned before I leave? Uh, no, I'm not gonna ban. I'm gonna time you out, okay? Like I, I never ban people though. So, yeah, that's not the policy. That's not the policy. Your favorite Call of Duty? Uh, Black Ops 2. Has to be Black Ops 2. What about you guys? Favorite game? Favorite Call of Duty? Why y'all snitching, dude? Because I, I, because we gotta keep a watch. We gotta keep a watch on you, man. You've been a bad boy, bro. 402 Thunder, or lost your comment here. Skizzle, do you know who 402 Thunder? Dude, I love 402 Thunder, man. I love my man. I love my man. I don't I don't know him in real life, though. Black Ops 2 for the life. 
Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 3 Zombies, though. 100%. I see Mike, I see Mike. PS5 good, Black Ops 1. Yo, what's up, Matthew? How you doing? Black Ops 2. Dumbass mods. Oh my god. Okay, my guy is trying to call out the mods here. Yo, uh, insane. Appreciate the subscribe and welcome on in. How you doing, man? We also got... Dude, it seems like that every time one person subscribes, like, everybody subscribes. And when nobody subscribes, like, literally nobody subscribes. Why? Why? That's... Yo, Gustav, thank you for subscribing. What's up? How you doing? Welcome on in. Nearing that well. These are 150k subs. You smashing it. Uh, smashing it, brother. Thank you, my man. We hit 145k yesterday, so that's crazy. You guys have been, you guys have been killing it, man. And seriously, I don't say, I, like deep down, I appreciate it, but sometimes like these words does not come out. Like they never come out, but like now that I have a chance, I want to say that I really appreciate all of you stud muffins. All right, like I really mean it when I say it. Like y'all are crazy, man. Like y'all are crazy. I, I love each and every single one of you, even you, Mike. Okay, just understand that that's why you're not, you're not banned. Uh, unseen, please just subscribing means a lot man and uh ubisoft stream if you're just coming on it's uh at 12 p.m pacific we're having a pre-show so when they're live i'm gonna let them talk i'm gonna shut up if they're talking for sure we're gonna have some memes we're gonna play some we're gonna play some that some of that if there are uh, some memes and whatnot if they mess up i'm gonna play the horn okay bring back prestige mode yeah they're uh they might bring it there have been rumors there has been rumors that say that they're they might bring Scorpio, I appreciate you too, man. Thank, thanks for the five paper, brother. Bro, are you excited for Prince? Or Persia, Sands of Time remake? I played... In the early days, I have played Prince of Persia. I'm not a huge fan of it, but I am excited to see. Like, I remember loving the game a lot as a child, as a kid. So, like, yeah, I'm excited for it. I'm excited for it. But it's not, like, I'm not fully... I'm not a Prince of Persia fanboy or anything, but I'm excited to see where they're gonna go. And if the game looks good, man, I'm probably gonna cop it because Assassin's Creed Valhalla is good, but it's low dopamine for me, man. You guys agree or disagree? Let me know, though. PS5 for 420 dollars. I wanna play as a USSR in Call of Duty. You talk too much. Uh, dude, you're watching a stream, dude. Like, I'm reading chat. There are so many people, so I gotta talk with everybody. You know? All Call of Duty games are trash. Of course, all of them are trash to you, Mike. We know that. We get it. You don't like it, man. We get it. Are they going to talk about PS5? They're gonna show us the, the PS5 and Xbox gameplay. Hoping they don't show PC gameplay. But they're gonna, like, reveal some new games. They said two surprises. Two surprise reveals. One of them has to be Prince of Persia. Did you finish the games you battled? Uh, not yet. I've, I'm only one hour in Detroit. But last time, dude, I finished God of War and Spider-Man in like five days, dog. Because I knew that I gotta finish them before. But now it's like, I, I told you, man. I told you it's gonna like take me some time because of these streams, right? Like, we got a lot. But I'm gonna try to finish them before Cold War comes out. Like, all of them. I never thought we would uh, be fishing in Assassin's Creed. Uh, that's... I like... Uh, yeah, fishing's kinda chill. But I'm not sure, like, you guys agree? You guys agree? Disagree? Like, to me, Assassin's Creed so far is low dopamine. Uh, capital E, I, I think you will disagree. I think to you, this is high dopamine content. But for me, it's low dopamine, though. I don't know, man. You guys agree? Disagree? Uh, let me know, man. Bro, please splinter cell. Please, some crab. Uh, crab. All consoles are really bad. Imagine playing console. But yeah, everything is trash to you, man. I get it. We get it. We get it, dude. We get it. We get it. We get it. You wave. We get it. You wave. I wanna play the Ottoman Empire, then play the Ottoman Empire, man. Let's do it. Nope, it's low dopamine for me too. All right, okay, finally we agree, right? Anybody? Okay, I wanna know if anyone disagree. Oh, thank you for the How are you doing? You like League of Legends? I I never really played League of Legends. Mr. Nibba was timed out by Movie King. Oh, damn. Homie got shot in the six. What did Mr. Nib Nibba said? Okay, he broke. said, It's cool. Ah, uh, and broke. That's what he said. Sony acting real quick. It's the calm before the storm. Watch. Imagine they come out and they uh, drop PS5 at a price of $498. What would you guys do? $1 less. And if you think that they're going to drop PS5 for $400? I don't believe in that. I don't think so. They're gonna make PS5 $400. But there, I've seen, I believe MBJ say that there's a rumor. I, I, I have not dug into it because I woke up and started streaming. Everything is low dopamine. All games suck. All games are boring. Not, not all games are boring, but some of them are. 
We need we need GTA 6. We need GTA 6. We need yeah, we need GTA 6. I think they need to like because right now they're dropping those concussion grenades on the community and whatnot. Like we need we need a shot of dopamine. I think 400 or 450 would be for the PS5 digital. Yo, what's up, Michelle? How you doing? One of the surprises is a Siege spin-off, and the other one would be Prince of Persia. Is that what you're trying to say, my guy? When are they revealing the PS5 Plus and the preview that released it? Uh, should be like should be this month. If it's not this month, then they're definitely doing helicopters with their willies, which they are. Yes, my haircut is amazing, better than yours, Mike. Are you saying that to me or someone in the chat? I hope that you're saying that to someone else. But you know what? If you're saying that to me, I hope that next time you enter the barber shop, this is the haircut you get. I hope that that barber kind of give you this haircut, man. Like, on, on God, on God. We need End Dead Nightmare 2 or GTA 6. I would say GTA 6. I I'll pick GTA 6. Could be Rainbow Six Quarantine. Yo, 2K Reactive, have you seen that clip? Of uh, that voice actor, Frank Wood's original voice actor. I forgot his name. I forgot the fool's name because I'm live streaming right now. I forgot his name. He said that, like, Jimmy Zelinsky, give him like two, three years, he's gonna have something very cool out. Uh, and I know that Jimmy Zelinsky is working on Rainbow Six Siege Quarantine, I believe, the zombies mode, so maybe he was talking about it. But he said, give or, give or take two, three years. Not like months, but years. So we'll see. Ed Head is. I agree. Fruit does not belong on pizza. That's a fact, man. Jalapeno, jalapeno and ba banana pepper, man. Probably the best. What's your guys' favorite p uh, pizza topping? Like mine is jalapeno, extra sauce, and uh, banana pepper. You give me that, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, like that, that's the, that's basically my, my, my thing, right? I will love you forever, man. That's the secret mushroom. Ah, uh, mushroom, mushroom's nice. Mushroom's nice, but not really, not really. I, I see, I, I see you, Sean. I see you. You have like a, one of those. Oh, you're one of those. Okay, you're one of those guys. <laughs> you're one of those guys. Uh, can you see my comments or no? I, I can see your comments. Man. It's never 50. It's always 29. Imagine. It's probably gonna be 349 though. But when I say, or I should say, like 450. It's 399, 499, or 599, 299. It's always it's never 50s. So, but but they. There's always a chance, bro. There's always a chance they can make it. They can make it 450 or 449, 99, because a hundred dollars cheaper for digital. I don't know, man. I don't know. That that sounds like cap, but it's a possibility. It's a possibility that the PS5 digital will cost 30, 399. Mike spam. Yeah, I see. I saw that. He got shot in the six by Movie King. Yeah, Movie King is not effing around. I see you, Movie King. You'll be back in five minutes, though. I don't think the Xbox Series S will be able to play any next generation games at 1440p. It will only do 1080p for the next generation. I think it will be uh, able to do the Xbox One and 360 games at 1440p though. Uh, I think if they're saying it, there, some games are gonna be able to do 2K though. But not every game, like, forget GTA 6, like, you know, in your dreams, GTA 6 is not gonna be 2k on series s but I, I think a lot of the launch titles will be 2k uh, at 2k tell these guys to stop spamming dude that's not how the internet works that's not how the internet works you tell people to not do something and uh, they will do it all right so reverse psychology so you say do it uh guys spam your tits off okay spam your tits off i don't care man Next time I'll add slow mode though. Okay, next time I'll add slow mode. Okay, we're uh, gonna make sure. But yeah, you do not say that uh, to the internet. You say you say that the internet will spam. So <laughs> yeah, that's a that's a thing. Favorite Battlefield? Battlefield Three or Bad Company Two? Bad Company Two Vietnam DLC was nice. Uh, but Battlefield Three, No Shark Canals, Team Deathmatch, Match uh, was my favorite. I think it's everybody. Everybody loved that shit though. You know why I'm not hyped for the Miles Morales? Because I will finish it before the sun sets. Mm. Yeah, you're a you're a gay box player, right? Yeah, I see you. <laughs> I see you. Guys, no no console war, okay? Like uh, just like how gay station exists, gay box exists, okay? Both of them are gonna do those, so. Uh, but nah, that these are facts. Like these are facts. The game is gonna be short. The game is gonna be short. But I really like Spider-Man. I played it though. It was 13 hours long. I finished it in about 3 days or 2 days, I think. 
you'll get a little bit more backstory. I wish there was a Dino Crisis. Two for the PlayStation. I miss it. Let me sip some water, man. Story that is not on the main path in any way, but it's still. Uh, drink water, not G fuel, by the way. Don't uh, don't don't use people codes, man. Just buy water. Buy water, guys. Uh, don't waste money on G fuel. Uh, if all games on the PlayStation 5 was in 8K, uh, some games will be upscaled, but like <laughs> 1 FPS or something like that. Uh, nah, don't expect 8K. Expect 8K upscaling though. For movies, for sure. For TV shows, for games, I think some games might be 8K, like you know Minecraft, Fortnite. But don't expect like GTA 6 or Call of Duty to be 8K, right? And 60 FPS. That's wild. Uh, RTX 3090 will do that though. Like I'm, I'm probably gonna cop it. Uh, just because I'm doing YouTube, right? Like I wanna, I wanna be able to render my videos within like two seconds and shit like that. PS5 digital at $400 would be competitive with the Series X because you are paying for a PS5 without a disc today. Same specs, you know? Yeah, exactly, bro. Except for the GPU, like they got 12 teraflops, and but we got 10.2 teraflops, so. You can spend as much yeah, yeah, it's gonna be real competitive and they're gonna make a lot of money in the long run with the digital If they get people to buy the digital version, they're gonna save a lot of money on printing discs uh, Printing covers and shipping that out to the retailers uh, because there's a lot of costs associated with shipping and that You know, so they're gonna save a lot of money on fees and whatnot and that extra extra bit of work So yeah, uh, I, I can see them making PS5 digital be $100 cheaper Yo, what's up, Raccoon? How you doing? All right, boys. Ubisoft live stream coming up. Which one are you getting, Skizzle? Uh, digital or physical? I'll get the physical. I'll get the physical. Water is the best ring, my fellow. Are you woke? Yes, I'm woke, my man. Yes, I'm awake. Skizzle is hydro, homie. What uh, is your favorite moment in GTA 5? Uh, a favorite moment. I would say that big ass plane heist mode, heist game, uh, mission. Yeah, that's my favorite. That's my favorite. That was like a jumbo jet, you know. That was my. Uh, I I gotta replay it. In fact, I'm replaying the GTA 5 single player, but I, I'm like two hours into it. Like I'm playing so many games right now that I have. Uh, <laughs> I'm playing like for two hours, then I'm like jumping on other games and shit like that. But I gotta finish that. I gotta replay it. But I remember that vividly that uh, that's one of my favorite missions. I don't remember anything about GTA campaign or story mode. Uh, I gotta replay it. What's your guys' favorite favorite GTA GTA uh, GTA game? Xbox Series X and PS5 and Minecraft. Should I get a PS5 or a PC? If you got the money and you don't care about what PS5 gotta offer in terms of exclusive games, like upgrade to RTX, man. Upgrade to RTX 3070 at least. Are you going to make a video today? Uh, most likely not today, cause like I'm streaming, but uh, I'll make a video tomorrow. If there's something big that drops, like later, I'll probably make a video. If you guys haven't already, I do Call of Duty gaming news, all that good shit. So guard me, subscribe, Mardo, and your name will uh, pop up on the streams, man. If you're new, I wanna know how many of you guys are new, man. If you haven't already, guys, hit that hit that subscribe button, or this will be me, all right? Or this will be me. Okay, seriously, man, hit the hit the subscribe button. I do everything, man. I'll keep you guys on the loops. And Ubisoft stream is coming up as well, 12 p.m. Pacific. What do you think about Xbox prices? Uh, they're very good, at least the Series S, and Series X is pretty good. Like, for $500, that's pretty nice, man. Like, for five, you cannot build a PC with the the same specs for $500. So yeah, console is the way to go if you if you're running low on moolah. Yo, Catalyst, thank you for subscribing. Welcome on in. PS5 got clapped. Uh, dude, they're gonna clap back. They're gonna clap back though. Been subscribed, best news for games. Clarence, appreciate it, my man. I gotta, <laughs> gotta burp. Been subscribed, best news, appreciate it. GTA San Andreas is the best video game of all time. To be honest, I remember playing that. The cheat codes were, were nasty, man. Like flying cars and shit in GTA San Andreas. You guys remember that? On PS2 and shit. The graphics felt like real life, but whenever I look back, it looks so bad, bro. It looks so bad, but we've came, we've came far, we've came far. We came a long way in terms of video games, graphics, and whatnot. But GTA San Andreas was really good. Yeah, I love that game a lot. Love that game a lot. 
PS5 499-98001. Most likely, man, that's Sony. You already know. Yo, thank you for subscribing, Alex, Alex Plays, and Cosmic. Welcome on in, you stud muffins. I remember it. You Indian or Pakistani? Uh, I'm Pakistani. Do you do any glute separation workouts? Glute? Uh, n I... <laughs> Uh, so far I have not so far I have not But maybe man, but what's uh, what's that glute separation workout? What's that? I gotta look up like I'm not sure what you mean The glutes of course you gotta do something for the glutes, but like separation that's I'm not sure that's nasty dog I gotta look into it. Maybe that's not nasty San Andreas is timeless. I just hope that they remaster that game bro Like I want that game remastered. I know they remaster it, but it's not really a real remaster like somebody else did it like some fool like some full remaster of like some third party company i believe like we need uh we need some we really need we really need a real remaster of gta scenarios my man skizzle using them whey proteins from them gyms and shit dude how do you know man dude yesterday was my first day to use the whey protein and shit like dead ass not lying not lying like i never use whey protein or anything like i just got 25 dumbbells at my home like i do not go to gym like uh, you know, it's the Roni situation, like, people out there, you know, spreading the Roni, this and that. I go to the parks and shit, like, there are chicks dancing, spreading the Roni. Like, they got, like, disco clubs going around, right? Like, in the parks and shit, spreading the Roni and whatnot. So I'm like, hey, man, I gotta, I gotta. Just like how soldier dodge bullets, like, I'm trying to dodge people right now, you know what I mean? Trying to, trying to make sure I'm Roni free, you know? Uh, bro, GTA San Andreas Remastered would be their excuse to not make GTA 6 till 2020. I hope they drop that, man. I hope they remaster GTA 4 too. I love those games. Make Mike for president? Nah, man. <laughs> nah, let's not do that. Let's not do that. Uh, okay, yo, I don't have the ca What? I don't have countdown? Yo, my bad, boys. My bad, guys. 23 more minutes. My bad. I thought I had countdown all. Oh, yeah, I had countdown, but I took it down. Before the pre-show, and the pre-show was poo, poo so like, yeah, okay, my bad, boys, my bad. 23 more minutes, guys. I thought I had the countdown on it. Apologies, boys. Apologies. 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 But yeah, 23 minutes till the stream. Uh, can you get Discord server or no? I, I do have Discord, but I don't use it. I don't use it. GTA, say, uh, GTA 4 was amazing. Dude, I want that remaster. I want that game remastered. Any news on games showing from Ubisoft? They're probably gonna have Assassin's Creed, Far Cry, Hyperscape, Rainbow, two surprise reveals. So one of them is probably Prince of Persia remake, and we'll see what's the other one, man. It's gonna push Alt plus F4. Nah, man. I don't wanna push that, man. What's that? What's that? What that will do, man? I don't wanna. Okay, now I'm tempted to try, but I don't wanna do it. Yeah, I'll, I'll do it after the stream. I'm not sure what that will do, man. I'm not a PC Methodist. I, I have not yet, Daniel. I'm like one hour in that game. Would you recommend it? Red Dead? I've, people have been saying that the story is really good, but the mechanics are bad. Got timed out by a mod. What did I... Uh, don't spam. Don't spam. You're probably gonna get timed out again by a mod, man. Don't spam like that. Only once. Uh, you can play a GTA 4 on Xbox. It's full backwards. But uh, full backwards is good, but I want... But that game is timeless, man. That game is amazing, man. Like, I want that game with good graphics and shit. Like, I want that game remastered. And I think that game deserve it because it came out, I believe, in 2008 or 2006. I think it's 2008. GTA 6 announced for Xbox 2. Far Cry Insanity VR is coming in 2021. Zero latency VR areas. VR can go pound sand, though. Like, any of you guys got VR? Okay, how many of you guys got VR? One if you got VR, two if you don't have VR. I'm expecting a lot of twos right now. We'll see. We'll see if people got VRs or not. I'm sick of getting timed out. No free speech confirmed. Dude, you can say anything you want to. Free speech is allowed, but it's like you're spamming. So that's what I'm saying. You can say what you want like two times maybe, but like not like... I don't want to see a wall of uh, that, you know? That's why mods are <laughs> kind of timing you out, man. So... Yeah, don't time out though. Uh, or I mean, don't uh, spam like that, man. Otherwise, you can say anything you want to. Okay? We, we get it, you vape. We get it. You vape. A lot of tools. We are a streaming pile of trash that will ruin gaming. Hey, that's a fact. And no, that's not a fact. Actually, I, I, I played VR. Uh, capital E, we did that, right? Like, I believe we did that to, in to, uh, 2018 or 2017 when we went to Toronto. I'm not sure when was that. 2018 or 2017? I don't know. 
But yeah, VR is pretty good. But it's like, I don't have it though, so it's like, you know what I mean. And Rockstar is, when, is also working on a game. They said that groundbreaking project. Uh, but that's a VR game, so not GTA 6. They're working on GTA 6 for sure, but probably gonna take years to put that one out. Would love to see a new Max Payne game. I love Max Payne. I love Max Payne. I would love to see that too, but I gotta... I want GTA 6 first. Don't press Alt F4. Yeah, I'm not gonna press it, dude. I don't even know what that will do. Like, I'll check it out. Like, I'll... Uh, okay, what does that... No, I'm, I'm kind of curious, man. I want to Google that. You know what? I'll do it after stream. I'm gonna put it on my notepad so I don't... Okay, Alt... I'm not gonna press the Alt plus F4 button, but like I'll tap it in my notepad because I wanna. I'm I'm curious right now, but I can resist it. I'm patient, okay? I'll, I'm not gonna do it on stream. Like imagine like that ends the stream, right? So, your live stream is making me feel better. Allah bless you, my G. I'll give you biryani sometime. Yo, do I do? I appreciate that, man. Means a lot, brother. And likewise, brother. Likewise. It terminates anything you're on. Oh, it like cancels all the. Oh, it exit the apps. I got you, okay? Thank you, thank you, experts. Yeah, we got some experts around, all right? Good shit, man. Like, yeah, that's why. Like, I don't believe a lot of you guys out there, but I believe, I believe that you believe it. I believe that you believe it, so. Yeah, and I, and I believe that shit, too, so. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm Google that shit after that. And I'm gonna try that out later on. But yeah, you learn something every day, I guess. Like, I didn't know about that. But of course, I'm not gonna try that, man. Like, if you're enjoying the stream, burn me like more, though, guys. How many likes were at though? Like, I only got my chat open, like, I'm not even sure, like, uh, how many people are watching, how many, like, people are chatting and shit, so... Uh, and I don't wanna know. I don't wanna know how many people are, like, watching or anything like that, but, like, uh, how many likes were at though? Like, can we get two likes? Can we get two likes, guys? It's good. What's up, homie? Rohin, what's up? How you doing? Born to party. Yeah, man. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Born to me is subscribe, man. What's in 19 minutes? Ubisoft reveal. Uh, new forward live stream. That's what it is. Almost 500 likes? For real? Yo, you guys are dirty, man. You guys are crazy. Yo, if we get, like, okay, limited time offer. If you get 2,000 likes. Last time I said 10,000. Yesterday, uh, yesterday I said 3,000. But today, limited time offer. If you get 2,000 likes, I'll get this haircut live on stream, alright? Only limited time offer, okay? Limited time offer. 2,000 likes and I'll get this haircut. But uh, 18 more minutes, guys. 18 more minutes till the stream. 438 likes. How big is a big... Uh, yeah, what's up? Hey, that's a lot of uh, information, man. Skizzle, bro, give me the name haircut. <laughs> yeah, this one? Yeah, that's Mimi, man. That's Mimi. I love that haircut, man. Look at my guy. Looking like a stud muffin out here, you know what I mean? That's so like 90s and early 2000s and shit. It already started. It's the pre-show. You know what? Let me put the pre-show on. But then, okay, hold on a second. Let me actually get that on. The the pre-show was low dopamine. That's why. Okay, let me actually put that here then. Yeah, I'll put that. The pre-show is kind of low dopamine. Yeah, I'll just pop that here. Yeah, let me stop the countdown here. Let me cut you. To workshopping with smaller groups of players and that has had a massively positive impact on our development so created a bunch of memorable moments in the ring and a few new areas for the team to focus the on good? yeah the experience overall was just great at the end of nights on certain days we would it's get together and though. put the top players against other top players to kind of see what the gameplay looks like at the highest level i'd say pretty I much I don't every session either. we had they were pretty much a new patch so. Yeah, I, okay, I'm gonna chill out with you guys because we got 18 more minutes. Uh, I don't believe you, man. You gotta actually hit me up on Twitter. Too loud? All right, good shit, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make sure to it's... Uh... Okay, tell me... Okay, so tell me if this is good. That is why from our first workshop, we've been adding moves, tweaking moves... Is this and good now? You can hear me well on shop so as well? we can find the best experience Of course, I'm not gonna talk over them later on about when they're, far. like, fully live. Now, this is pretty sure I'm just, like, testing. If this is good, give me a one. Or tell me if it's too loud or a little loud. And tell me what's loud, like, am I loud or are they loud? Uh, cause I can fix it, because we got, we got, like, 17 minutes and I can always fix it. And she do be looking like a snack, though, so. Yeah, that's kinda good as well. When I see beauty, I appreciate it, okay? 1.5, too loud? Little loud? I got you, okay, so let's see. Gameplay, art, lore, and so much more. Blueprints are not only about giving you visibility, they also mention you know? discussion through voting and activities. If you wanna jump in with us, okay, then follow so us on social, or join us Okay, I'm gonna lower it down for now. We're gonna chill out. 17 more minutes, boys. Uh, kill the like button with an AK-47. 
They're loud, too quiet, that, that's loud, it's good, perfect. Okay, so yeah, I'll roll with that when they're uh, in 16 minutes. I'll do that, man. Kill the like button. One if you, uh, one with you being just loud enough. I got you, okay, so that's perfect. Alright, I see you guys, I see you, man. Good shit, man, good shit. Aggressively French accent. Dude, I love the French accent. Yeah, that's Ubisoft, right? Like, if you <laughs> if you watch Ubisoft, they got so much uh, French accent going on. That's wild, bro. Dog, that's wild. Like, instead of saying dirty, they say dirty. That's very dirty, my friend. Like, I love the French accent. French and Russian accent, probably the best. 570 likes. Yo, thank you all for that, man. I appreciate it. Welcome on in if you're new as well. Anthony, I see you. Thoughts on Cold War? Uh, not mind blown, but looks good. French girls looking like a snake. They do, that's a fact. Uh, Ubisoft has bit interesting to me. RXV enjoying the emotes out here. Ubisoft bag it. <laughs> Are you getting watchdogs? Uh, most likely, most likely. Not 100% sure. Yo, what's up, Armurd? Titan, what's up? How you doing? So what make you? What made you start YouTube? Honestly, it came naturally. It came naturally. Like I don't even know. I think I was inspired off of uh, Freddy W and Smosh. Yeah, but it's like I, I think I always loved making videos. So it started like I started that shit, and then I got arrested one day because I was running around the streets with the uh, with the GoPro mounted and the airsofts. Like because I was inspired off of Freddy W. I was, I was making like. Call of Duty Battlefield in real life video. I was like, what, like 14, 13 years old and I got arrested. I mean, was not arrested, but it's like the cops kind of pulled over and they kind of like left me, uh, they kind of gave me, a, they gave me a ride to my home. So after that day, I discovered Ali and T Martin, you know, and then I kind of got into Call of Duty. Then, I d then I've done like Battlefield. I've done literally everything on the channel, like Call of Duty, Battlefield, Zombies. And now I cover all the gaming news, right? I was sick that day. Yeah, you were. My man didn't came, so capital E, he's in the chat, like, he survived that. But the cops gave me a ride, though. The cops were chill, man. They, they, they were chill. They were chill, but they kind of confiscated our airsoft. They took my airsofts away, though, so that was wild. Damn, you gangster skizzle. Yeah, man, trust me, you don't want to come near me, man. You never know, like, I might pull out a... You do not know, man, I'll... You never know, man. Like, I got this shit, okay? I got that shit, man. I live that life. No, I'm just kidding, man. But yeah, Elliot, dude, Elliot, Team Martin, that was, that shit was wild, that shit was wild, like, during Black Ops 2, man, they were popping. FaZe was on top, Elliot was on top, I mean, right now, they are on top, I'm not saying that they're not, they are on top, in fact, more than ever, but Call of Duty-wise, they were on top, uh, around that time. Can a bit, uh, can a Ben beat Saber if he spams again? Uh, just timeout, timeout, uh, timeout, like, if somebody's spamming, though, uh, don't ban anyone. Do you have any favorite uh, Assassin's Creed game? The last one I played was Assassin's Creed Black Flag. I would say Assassin's Creed 2 was the best, in my opinion. But ladies and gentlemen, 13 more minutes till Ubisoft livestream. Hopefully we get some memes. Hopefully we get some good games showcase. I don't know what they're gonna show, like... They said two surprise reveals. Yo, thank you for subscribing, man. What's up? How you doing? You stud muffin? The Xbox Series X extended uh, storage cost $220 for like what, 1 terabyte or 500 gigs? It's gonna be SSD, that I know. So 1 terabyte SSD, is that what you mean? 220 that's cheap, bro. That's real cheap. I mean, $220 is expensive, I'm not saying it's not cheap, but like for an SSD, like if it's 500 or 1 terabyte, that's cheap though. That's cheap. Because I know the prices were real high. Charlie Intel doesn't have an Intel on Prestige mode and Black Ops Cold War 3 is still working on it because of the community response and I hope that they bring it. Download Among Us, it's five dollars on Steam now. Nah, that's way too expensive, man. That's way too expensive. <laughs> I don't wanna I don't wanna buy it. Uh, but if the game is good, because I know like I'll probably get I'm probably not gonna play the game, right? For one terabyte? Yo, that's cheap. That's cheap. 220 for one terabyte SSD, that's cheap. Ben Movie King. Uh, nah, Movie King didn't do anything, man. He's a, he's a nice boy. You think there will be Far Cry 6 gameplay? Uh, most likely, yeah. I hope so. They said Far, they said Far Cry in their description. So I'm hoping that they show us. Are they bringing back League play on Call of Duty World, World Cold War from Black Ops 2? I think, th I hope they do, but they're probably gonna have skill-based matchmaking in the game, so... I'm kind of worried about it, man. I hope they bring I hope they bring league play instead of skill based matchmaking. Like have skill based matchmaking and league play. That would be much better. How many days until Xbox gets survival mode, Lamau? I, I think yo, yeah, it's okay, so it's September 10th. 
October. So yeah, three weeks, 21 days till they get it. Yeah, three weeks, man. Yeah, man, you guys have been patient. Any of you, any Xbox player out there? But honestly, Modern Warfare Survival was like... I mean, it was nothing, man. Compared to Modern Warfare 3 Survival, it was jack shit, dog. They didn't do jack shit with that. Like, it was bad. So it's like, if you're on Xbox, you're not missing anything, right? But still, like, they waited a year, man. They waited. They, yeah, who cares about that mode, right? I cared about that mode, and I gotta say, it wasn't even that good. It wasn't, it wasn't good. So, if you're an Xbox player, you're not missing anything. Eleven more minutes, Chad. Eleven more minutes till disaster. Let's see what this, uh, what they're saying. I started working in the industry as a QA tester. I started in the late 19s as a game tester. I started as a tester because I think all all developers almost start as testers, it's very common. And then I was hired, I was a scripter at first, then became a level designer, uh, mission designer, uh, and after that, uh, team lead, ass assistant level design director. Is the volume good, boys? And yeah, I don't no want it to be too loud. I got loud. this opportunity through a friend, actually. Uh, a good friend of mine joined. After some time, he said, man, it's, it's awesome here, you should, you should come. I did something completely different in the past. I'm um, actually uh, I learned and uh, did this for many years. Uh, Endurance and finance advisor. No, so I, I, I don't did, read my uh, A job in a suit, right? J'ai commencé il y a bien longtemps en télévision. J'ai commencé dans le domaine du cinéma. I used to work in medical imaging uh, as a project manager. That's good. Manager. Yeah. All right. Good shit, guys. Good shit. That's what allowed me to get my foot in That's the door. That's what I here like, boys. I actually left an IT company for a gaming company, so that's it. I loved gaming since the very start. So my background Follow is actually the passion, in drinks. Follow the passion. Well, I've always loved gaming and I've always wanted to get into gaming, but there's just never been that opportunity. I was just lucky enough to apply for this job at Ubisoft and it all just Okay, I'm going to talk over them for a little way. bit. Tell me if my real. voice is louder than them. If it is, I'm going to turn, I'm gonna turn <laughs> up their volume like just a tiny bit. Okay, I want to do something different. This is not what one I want to do. This is interesting, but I would like to try something else. Why not video games? You're young, you can try it. What I have to lose. And they said, okay, you're hired. If you want to join and you think you have the right <laughs> skills, well, me. Ben Skizzle for simping? Nah, man, I've been on NoFap since January 12, dog. Like, no. <clears throat> no, simping. Your if, voice is like perfect. I do shit. You're interested in starting Spencer, your thank own you for the career two in video games. Or three. You can check Appreciate out our current job openings think? at jobs. Uh, do you think there's any chance for new zombies info? Uh, there has been some new information today. I'll make a video on it tomorrow, all right? Or tonight. I got you on that and there's a lot more to come. But for now, the team is excited to share a sneak peek of year four, season three. Thank you for the three, my guy. Yeah, nine more Maybe minutes till the actual stream. The warmongers were right. Do you guys think we will get PS5 launch day, launch day today? No, not today. Maybe we were foolish to hope for more. Yo, if we get games like that, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be sad. Maybe we deserve to be Okay, story was pretty crazy. It would be easier to give up and let them decide our fate. But we won't. You started too early, Mom? How long is the, uh, this event? Should be one hour long. To start. Oh my god, this is low dopamine, okay? Let's hope that the actual stream is high dopamine. A rebellion. rebellion. And that is Poana. Poana resistance. Y4 or S3. Alright, 8 more minutes, chat. 3070 Ti and we gonna play that shit? Yeah, dude. We are RTX happy 30, to announce anyway. that 400 Don't forget. has reached the 25 million player milestone. That's truly amazing. Big thank you to the entire 400 community. For those who want to learn more about the next season that was teased in this trailer, stay tuned for an upcoming 400 Warriors Den on their official Twitch channel. Now, for the latest on Tom Clancy's The Division 2. The team at Ubisoft Massive in Malmo, Sweden has an exciting new game mode called The Summit. Let's see what it's all about. Your new man, welcome on in, dude. Uh, yeah, seven more minutes till the actual stream starts, man. I'm hoping they show big games, man. I want to see the big games. I want to see the Prince of Persia. I want to see the Far Cries. I want to see... Yeah, some new gameplay of Watch Dogs would be nice, too. 
Okay, what did the homie say? He's gonna love your content. Read, read, uh, Nasser, shout out to you, my man. Uh, but don't spam like that. Don't spam. I see you. I see you, though. Because uh, uh, the mod will time you out, though. Do you think Battlefield 6 teaser is in this? Nah, not, not here. Battlefield 6 is EA, yeah, uh, not Ubisoft. Yo, this look good, though. Rainbow? Is it Rainbow? Yeah, it's Rainbow. Right? I didn't see the title name. How many of you guys play Rainbow, though? Yeah, Rainbow. I wish you could jump in Rainbow. Like, I don't want to offend anybody. Like, okay, I'm not a Rainbow player, so I really cannot, like, give my opinion on it. Rainbow's not for me, though. Oh, we got a Vamin Operator. Ah, oh, it's Division? Ah, oh, it's Division. Ah, oh, it's Division. My bad, boys. I didn't see the title. Far Cry 6 gameplay? Hopefully there is. What's the stream about? Ubisoft. They're gonna be revealing new games and show us, uh, showing us some PS5 Xbox gameplay. Let's hope not PC gameplay. The higher you climb, the tougher it gets. Okay. <laughs> this gives life after answering stupid questions. I play Rainbow. Rainbow is fun, but it gets boring real fast. Uh, Capitally, you you like Rainbow, right? I think you love Rainbow. Yeah, you love Rainbow. Oh, the same day Xbox Series X is gonna go for a pre-order. Can we college? Oh shit, that's dark. Oh shit. Code name Nightmare. Okay, that was nothing, dude. I was hyped prematurely. I got Hello, hyped prematurely. Hello, I'm Yannick Banchereau. Here at Massive, we are excited to bring you The Summit, a new game mode that will have you challenge your way up 100 floors Bethany, and where excited. every attempt will be unique. It will come alongside Season 3, Concealed Agenda, as we continue the story with the leader of the Black Tusk, Barden Schaefer. Later this year, we will be Lit bringing out. you Season 4 that will see the return of Fei Lao and a new time-limited in-game event that will be a truly memorable experience. Memo and finally, I am thrilled to confirm that the Division 2 will be backwards compatible with next-gen consoles. Dude, I love this accent. Okay, Russian accent and when French people speak in More English, news on that the accent is fire, fire will be coming bro. I love that accent. This year. And it will be available for players who are making the switch to next-gen console. In the meantime, you can try out the Division 2's new Summit game mode, starting on September 22nd. And if you haven't played the Division 2, the upcoming free weekend is a perfect opportunity to give it a try. And now, it's time to send it over to you, our players, our fans, our communities. Let's see what kind of cool stuff you've been up to in our games in the latest episode of WoW Moments. All right, let's check it out. WoW Moments? WoW Moments more like... Far Cry 4? Oh shit, that's... Yeah, what's the name of this music? <clears throat> I love this. I love the soundtrack. Unless the French person is XQC. Are you going to get Resident Evil? Uh, most likely. Maybe I'll do. Da, 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 da. Oh my man, homie got shot. Anybody knows the, the, the name of the, the that song? That's kind of good, like, I like that. Three what? more minutes, boys! What? Three more minutes. Okay, that game's kind of fun, man. I like that game. Never played it, but, like, looks kind of fun with that. Kind of arcade, you know what I mean? All right, Ross, stop spamming. Do you read manga? No, I don't read manga. You read manga, my guy? Do you read manga, my guy? It's all I'm not giving it 50. I'm just What is this game, dude? Are you serious? Yo, Uno's fun, man. Yo, Capital E, we gotta play Uno someday again, all right? Yeah, we gotta play Uno, man. Uno's fun. Uno and Chess, man, I love that show, dog. Uno fag bag, dude. Uno's fun. With friends, it's fun, dude. Like, I played it for the first time. Like, uh, like two weeks ago at this point. I loved it. I loved it, man. I have on PS4. Oh, hey, bon check soir, excuse me. Yo, qu'est-ce que c'est, my guy? Hey, good day, Sally. There you go, man. Sally, Sally. There you go. Figment of your imagination. Gandu. Gandu. Okay, so two more minutes. Rainbow Six. Tool Shire. Yeah, Rainbow is so like. I like Rainbow. I don't like Rainbow. I like Rainbow. I don't know. The on for the on. This is a Vogel. 
Yeah, I need to get to, uh, get into Rainbow. Like, I only played once. I have the game, though. One day you'll beat me in chess. I beat you the last... What you mean, dude? I beat you last time. I beat Jagannath. You know Jagannath. I beat Jagannath, man, with the timer and shit like that. Yo, a speed, a speed chess is my favorite, man. That with the five so minutes cool. timer. And thank you to everyone who submitted some gameplay. If you have any clips you want to share with us, you can head over to wowmoments.ubisoft.com. You might even be featured in the next episode of Wow Moment. That's all for us. The main event is about to begin. Thanks for watching the Ubisoft Forward pre-show. Up next, the main show featuring new announcements and a few surprises you don't want to miss. Nah, must be Prince of Persia. I think it's Prince of Persia. All right, boys, it's gonna start. We're gonna, we're gonna test it out. That works. Now bring the memes. I, I hope that the F up at least once, because uh, it's gonna be good for the memes. I'm on good games, don't get me wrong, but you know, if they if they don't F it up, this like it's not gonna be good for the memes. We need memes, real. we need memes, all right? I hope that they fail at least one of them. Uh, one of the reveal. Like, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna have some memes. Straight out of the oven, all right? All right, 54 seconds, boys. Let's get it. The horn is back. Yeah, dude, I got it yesterday, man. Perfect timing. Do you guys, you guys think that they're gonna F up at least once or not? I gotta support Daddy Skizzle. I love you, my stud muffin. I love you, man. Exactly, like, if there are no memes, it's not gonna be fun, man. We need memes. We need them to fail at least. But I want good gameplay too, though. I want good gameplay too. I want good shit too, but need memes, man. Need at least one F up. Need one F up. We need that. Ubisoft forward. 17 seconds until Ubisoft forward. I want that French accent. I want them to F up at least once or twice. I want good gameplay. And that's it. I don't have high expectations. That's the... These are the three things I want. Oh my god. Yo, those numbers and shit with the colors? Really kind of sure. This is Ubisoft forward. Okay, they had that French accent. Meet the devs. See the game. Oh, she got kicks. Yo, she had kicks. Join us. Join us. Ubisoft Forward with that reverb on it. Fire. Welcome back to Ubisoft Forward. I'm Yusuf. I'm Neela. Today's show will reveal new games, give behind the scenes insights from our development teams, and share some exciting updates on projects you've been waiting for. Let's get started with a game you've been waiting to hear more about since it was teased last year. The gods of ancient Greece need a hero, and it's time to answer the call. I think this is it, boys. We're gonna have one F up, hopefully. I'm expecting this to be a cartoons game, cartoonish game. Imagine As the it's world not. crumbles, our divine powers render in game away. engine. Wow, dude. Even the gods need a hero. Let's check it out. Hey, hola, hey, Fortnite 2.0, what's up? Imagine, yo. We got a big ass mother effer, big dick energy going on here. We got women power. Yeah, there we go, guys. RTX 3090. <laughs> I knew you were gonna say that movie thing. I knew it, I knew it. Wow, dude. Alright, okay, okay, I'm glad. You know, we need memes. We need memes. So I'm fine with that shit, dog. I'm fine with that. Anybody, anybody gonna play that? But might be fun, though. I'm just joking around. Okay, don't be offended, though. Like, if you're new here, yo, thank you for subscribing, man. Uh, don't be offended, though. 3090? So, uh, wow, dude. That moment power? Yo, that music is so like the music's good i like the music i like the music it's mimi it's mimi yo that's straight from god of war 2 though there was a creature in god of war 2 that resembles yeah i'll play who doesn't love zelda love maybe show gameplay instead of cinematics oh my god yo she got yeah, the character model's good. <laughs> Got them wings, though.
God damn. It got that sword and then she clapped it, dude. She clapped it. it got that pog. Yo, pog you, my guy. Unreal Engine. Unreal Engine minus three. Unreal Engine minus three. Yo, reminds me of that. Immortals. Banks. Rising. Alright. Alright. December 3rd, 2020, Xbox Series. Yo, that was X coming to PS5 and I'm Series the game X. director on Immortals Phoenix Rising. I hope you enjoyed Next our end. reveal video. I'm sure you noticed a lot of new things since we first teased the game, including a new name. Immortals. Yeah, next on gameplay, Extra boys. production time has allowed us to expand our vision and explore new opportunities beyond our initial plan. We felt the name Immortals Phoenix Rising better reflected this new experience. Today, we're incredibly excited to give you the first in-depth look at our world, hero, and gameplay. Let's dive oh. in. Music's so sad, man. I feel sad already, bro. A grand mythological Immortals adventure. Immortals Phoenix Rising is a third-person, open-world action-adventure game set in the fantastical landscape of Greek mythology. You'll play as Phoenix, a Greek warrior shipwrecked on the mysterious Golden Isle. Graphics are Isle. really good, man. Upon your arrival, you'll meet Hermes, one of the few remaining gods of Olympus. Hermes has heard of a prophecy that only you can save the Greek gods and reclaim their realm from Typhon, the deadliest titan in mythology. This mm. entire epic story oh, will be narrated there, by the titan Prometheus and Zeus, the king of the gods. Oh shit, yeah, they're using that story. commentary and perspective to this legendary tale. It's Zeus on show. Yeah, I got a kick of like dopamine right there because I love going. Before God of embarking War. on this perilous journey, you'll get to create your own Phoenix. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and as guys. As you progress, you'll find <laughs> even more opportunities character. to customize your character by discovering legendary weapons, unique pieces of gear and cosmetics, and earning the gods' blessings and mythical abilities that can turn the tide of battle. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. You'll need all the help you can get to save the gods and defeat Typhon once and for all. Okay. On your journey to save the gods, you'll grow stronger and achieve new, incredible things, like gliding with the wings of Daedalus to jump higher, fight while airborne, and glide freely in the open world. Facing off against dangerous mythical beasts like the giant Cyclopses, flying harpies, and huge multi armed flying harpies? Tonkeries. <laughs> now he said harpies or Harnessing the power know. of the gods to master a tactical and fast paced, over the top combat system. Wow. And solving puzzles and challenges scattered Yo, this throughout is God the world War, dog. to help improve like your power. Opening powers. of the chest and shit. God of War with Unreal You'll Engine also get to minus four. An epic, vibrant, and stylized open world filled with secrets, puzzles, and stories rooted in Greek mythology. Yeah, Greek mythology. Yeah. Once Yo, a peaceful the home fun, to though. the gods of Olympus, the Golden Isle is now overrun by creatures of the underworld. To stand a chance against Typhon and his minions, you'll need to explore this mysterious land Guys, and gay, become gay a mythical or banger. hero gay or yourself. Banger. I wanna know. The gay world is divided in multiple regions, all ruled by a different god in need of your help. From the lush landscapes of Aphrodite's plains to the mechanical world of Hephaestus's forge, each region is packed okay, with challenging battles, it? ancient puzzles, and secrets to uncover. You'll have but the, the freedom good, to explore man. this entire open world as you wish, right from the beginning of your journey. I'm gonna buy pretty Finally, stay with us for the game. post show, where you'll get a look at new gameplay. All right, gameplay coming in hot, boys. I hope you enjoyed what you saw today. We can't wait for you to play Immortals Phoenix Rising. There's a lot more to show before launch, so keep an eye out for further updates. See you all on December 3rd. PS5, Xbox I'm so Series X. Oh, to shit, play this where's game? the gameplay? It's a world I just can't wait to explore. Hi, I'm Phil Harrison. We're looking forward to Immortals Phoenix Stadia Rising gameplay? coming to Stadia on December 3rd. We're also excited to announce that all Stadia players will get a chance to try Immortals Phoenix Rising with a free playable demo before launch that is exclusive to Stadia. All you'll need is a Gmail account. With just a single click, you'll be able to add the demo to your Stadia library and instantly join Phoenix on her quest to save the Greek gods. 
Created specifically for this Stadia demo, Ubisoft have developed an entirely unique island for you to experience. Mm -hmm. We hope Stadia, you'll love what it. The, awful, dude. the exclusive Stadia demo of Immortals Phoenix Rising will be playable later this year in all regions where Stadia is accessible. Thank you to Yves Guimau and the entire Ubisoft Quebec studio for your partnership in bringing amazing experiences yeah, ladies and to gentlemen. Stadia. The I use apologize of Zeus and Prometheus as the narrators in Immortals it's Phoenix Rising Stadia. led to a I unique style of storytelling. Here's Michelle Plourd to tell us more. All right, we got Michelle. My name is Michelle Plourd. I'm lead cinematic designer on Immortals Phoenix Rising. Immortals. I think the number one thing that I love about my job is the sense of pride that I get for delivering a scene. Yes, it's Our job is consistent cinematics. with someone who is actually directing. We get to direct where we're shooting, what lens we're using, oh and what's God. happening in the scene. Immortals Phoenix Rising, it's a very narrative-driven game, but it's also very lighthearted and stylized and very comedic. And I feel like that's where we get to shine as cinematic designers. One of the best examples I have actually for this is Zeus and Prometheus are bickering because uh, Zeus is very, very yeah, Zeus is looking so, like yeah, Zeus, story. Oh so he decides God, to spawn some monsters. And then they just kind of yeah, Zeus is looking like a stud. And then the character <laughs> sees so just out kind here, of man. on them because man. we were trying to hit comedic timing. You so got a little work. moments, they kind of like lightheartedness work, and part of the game that that's we, a, we really like to showcase. You know, that's a plus one right there. Ubisoft really likes to tell stories. And I think that's how you get the players to really be engrossed within God the of War uh, PS2. You oh, want to no. make God them War, feel something. God of War PS even minus if it's just four a laugh gameplay. or a chuckle. I think we did our job. Soldier Boy game console gameplay. Yeah, let me put it that way, dude. Keep an eye out for further updates on Immortals Phoenix Rising before Yo, you it launches that. You've this <laughs> December 3rd. <laughs> you guys seen this? Now, oh my God. it's he time to revisit a Like a stud friend. donut out here, man. The job. <laughs> yeah, man, the job confirmed. Okay. Guys, Most this is gonna be a good one. Time I like swear. A river that flows oh shit, Prince of Persia? In one direction. Oh shit. But I have seen the face of time. You gotta I can look at the chin, bro. They are wrong. Oh my god, Habibi. Prince of Persia, the fan. Yeah, the, the leaks were true. No living man has ever seen. Only Looking like a snake. Can unlock the sands of time. No! Yo, that's a W, man. That's a W. Yo, no. good shit. Yo, you guys hide for it? Smash like if you are. I saw my father turn to sand. Dislike if you're not. You cannot defeat this enemy. The sands will consume everything. The graphics are him. not crazy, but... But I warn you, I move pretty fast. You'd better keep up. Nah, the graphics are not crazy, but... Prince, the dagger, it can turn back time. Yo, I got a kick of dopamine, man. Oh, shit's legendary. Yeah, we need more gameplay. We need gameplay. We need gameplay. Give me the dagger! Never! Yo, nah, I, I got a kick of dopamine, man. Banger or gay, guys? Banger or gay? I better see Banger in the chat. I brought this on us. You are brave. Oh, they're having... Oh, they're trying to do Easter eggs. Good shit, man. Hide Don't your wives. Hide, hide your kids. Yeah, she, the, the character looks like a snack. Yeah. So we're going to have Easter eggs and whatnot. Oh, PS4 Pro, not PS5. What the fuck? My name January is uh, Anukol. I'm working in an Ubisoft from past 13 years. 13 a years, my friend. Uh, Prince of Persia, okay, Sands my friend. By the way, I'm Pakistani, so don't dream. be offended. It's not a project. It's a we dream have that, kind of uh, accent, that is you know, uh, coming true. Coming true, my friend. Uh, Dog, nah, now we're gonna have Easter eggs in the game. Prince of Persia, you know, people love this game. It love has this put game. a mark in everyone's heart. And now what we are going to do is we are going to bring it back because still people have they that like nostalgic feeling. People want to play dude, that I'm, game. I'm Pakistani, dude. I'm Pakistani. We Pakistani in, in Indian, studio, same, it's same shit, Ubisoft like same, uh, same accent. So, we actually know. love to work on this so game not, because we don't can be offended, show don't be everyone, you know, what India is. It's something which comes directly from our heart. So, you know, the main game which was uh, made back then, the main essence is there. All the characters are there. You have your prince, prince who's uh... very iconic, who was in this game. You have the princess, Farah. <laughs> 
And yeah, literally, she do we have a Buzzy nice. who's a villain like in doing. this game with all the sand creatures, you know. It just, we have given it a boat, bit more flavorness, bit more enhancement. Mm. Yep. The voice which we are using for the prince is Yuri, the same voice which was back then. You know, it oh, just put one, goosebumps on our hands also when we heard him <laughs> because you know, it's something which, which brings back to us to the, that, that nostalgic feeling. How did you... Some people say feeling. time is like a river that flows swift and sure in one direction. 17 uh, years quiet. later, but you know, the main good thing is his voice hasn't changed at all. I don't know how he do it, but it's the same. <laughs> yeah, you guys Being able to work on the Prince of like, Persia is a huge honor because I think it's honor. a beloved game. Beloved game, 2003 original game, my we friend. We respected the original design. We respected the storyline. We respected story the characters. We just nah, dude, I love this game, everything man. in the game from camera w, that's a to w. combat as well as the visuals. Remake. Nah, dude. Prince of Persia, man. We a targeted system, Big man, man. Big which man. actually enhanced the velocity of the prince and his abilities to do amazing performance and amazing moves. Yeah, I don't care about graphics. We use the uh, latest technology it, the game fun, as well though. as the motion capture to bring realism and to bring logic and sense into the story. We heard the player's desire to play Prince of Persia Sands of Time again, and we are very pleased to bring it as the first ever remake from Ubisoft. Ubisoft, yo, damn, it's a she's looking story. like a snack, man. She, very, she very wifey right there, man, wifey material, man. I've been on NoFab, so like, Prince of Persia like, Sands of Time still remake releases January 2021 on the PS4, yo, fandom, how, what's Xbox up? One, and are you doing? PC. It's time to head over to the virtual Are you the fandom of that I follow on Twitter? We're in an I intense and fast-paced battle rages on. So, chat, uh, what are your thoughts on the game so far? You guys like it? Banger? Gay? Erectile? Dysfun you got erectile dysfunction or you got hit in the Money. G spot? Hyperscape kind of poo poo, though. So. Yeah, I've never felt paid, like that. Paid actors. Paid board. actors. But I paid, think I like it. Paid streamers. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, you will. <laughs> Yeah, half first game. Nah, get the ammo. Well, look at all this man. That was to be dang. Low dopamine. Was low dopamine? I think it was high dopamine. They had some Easter eggs as well in the game. Dude, be mad. Ah, yo, yo, fandom. What's up, man? What's up, my G? I'm gonna play that for you, of course, man. But just making sure it's not an imposter fandom. Just, uh, you know what I mean, right? Because there, there can be two fandom pups too, you never know, right? So. Oh but how you doing, man? What's up? How's the wife and the children? That in be next gen just cannot be. The graphics are bad, but it's like... At the end of the day, it's all about you guys. Paid streamers, though. These are paid streamers, by the way. She looking like a snack, I, I gotta say that one. Join the future of Battle Royale, my friends. Play free now. Hyperscape, hyperscape.com slash play. Ubisoft. One big focus for the Hyperscape dev team is to regularly add gameplay content and features, keeping the game new and fresh week after week. Looking like a bug snacks? <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. I must steal that line. Yeah, she do be looking like a bug snack, bro. Yeah, Hyperscape can go pound fan. And if you guys like... Any of you guys like Hyperscape? One if you do, two if you don't. It's perfectly fine if you do like it, but it's just like another battle royale game, you know what I mean? I mean, it's free, so it cannot really be mean. What's with that accent? I love that French accent, man. That French accent that Ubisoft, I love it, man. I, I do speak French, too. I do speak French. J'ai pas le français aussi, mais so je sais comment l'accent est, so j'adore ça, my guy. Like, don't be offended, man. Like, I'm Pakistani, I can do Indian this accent. This next so one you know is I mean? for the like, fans. Pakistani accent, Indian accent. So don't, don't be offended, man. Don't be offended. Just jokes, man. Just be jokes, man. Look at what I just tweeted you on Twitter. It's very important. Yeah, I've seen that. Uh, right, their Twitter got yanked. That was Twitter got yanked. It's a heartbeat, a pulse, a distinct vibration. Mm. All right, let me get back it's to you search. guys. Ubisoft is an irrelevant the shit game. They do have some good games though. It's like Watch Dogs, I'm in Watch Dogs. But everything you believed in. You 
da, they be cooking. Nothing you expected. Drop it, spin land now, and keep on jumping. It's nothing you could have trained for. You had everything you would have wanted. Yeah, no mask. You could have imagined. Yeah, spreading the road. You always needed. Make sure you guys are washing your hands before smashing it's the like button. You Yo, thank you for subscribing, brother. Uh, Eclipse, welcome, welcome it's on everything in. You accomplished. Yeah, they got an ad. Everything oh my god. For. If I was this guy's barber, you know that I would be giving that man this haircut, okay? Like, let me put it that way. He won't be getting that clean shaven head, like, he would be getting that haircut, man. Garnu box? Yo, she was undressing? What? That's tapped. Share every action, share every emotion, share every nah, this is a good album. I like share it. every success, every triumph. Yeah, share yeah, good album. Good album. Your friend, your family, your teammates, <laughs> your people, <laughs> your country. Share yeah, that that haircut. The unforgettable. Legendary man, like that haircut. Tedinam haircut, man. Legendary, bro. Le français Xavier Daniel, he's sport director for Ubisoft. Today we are proud to have more than 60 million players of Rainbow Six Siege Leal. and we can say that we are top tier eSports title. It was the right moment to have a, a new layer of competition. We are working on eSports for the last five years when we define a professional system uh, with organization and regional model. So the Rainbow Six World Cup is a new layer of competition of our eSports ecosystem. It will be the first time we have a country-based competition for our eSports title. In the Rainbow Six World Cup, we'll have 20 teams participating to the main event, but more than 45 countries will participate to the qualifier. Qualifier. For such yeah, a special for occasion, occasion Welcome on in. we are very happy to introduce Tony Parker, our ambassador for the Rainbow Six ambassador. World Cup. Tony Parker. Very proud to be with Tony Parker today. So he will be the ambassador of our first Rainbow Six World Cup. That's so, what I heard. Yes. The rumor. Is the rumor in the I love that franchise. So you are man. part of uh, all the process of uh, thinking about the World Cup. Uh, you will meet uh, the players. I love the you, coaches. the puzzle world. But Thank you, man, all, for I'm taking a shower happy. before very smashing the like button. I love the opportunity to be an ambassador of the Rainbow Six, for the first Rainbow Six uh, World Cup. Uh, thanks for, for, for choosing me. Uh, I'm excited to meet all the players and uh, explain to them how special it is uh, to play for your country. Uh, it's very different than team playing, you know, like when you go to your country and you listen to the national anthem and you have the goosebumps and, and you know, uh, uh, it's, it's a great honor. These guys, they play for organizations that don't play for their country yet. Uh, for them, it will be something completely different. Uh, it will be the first time they will not play with their teammates. They play. Uh, yes, yeah, uh, so it should be later. Uh, what would be your advice? Enjoy Far Cry after this. We should have Watch Dogs too. Uh, to play in the international they competition. It's Ubisoft. Uh, and Yo, then there's all the pressure around it, you know, because Walk when you play for the country, a lot XD. of pride comes in and, and it's going to be a whole new uh, competition. Uh, but I'm sure uh, if they can feel what I felt, you know, they will love the, the experience. And, uh, and I think in the global scale for Ubisoft and Rainbow Six to take that yeah, challenge they're high to on do G a, fuel. A, a World Cup, uh, I think it can be big, you know, for the future, for the future of the game. I think it's just a huge yeah, don't drink uh, opportunity, guys. you know, and drink I'm very water. proud to Water's be here. Very good, trust me. I swear. I An swear. ambassador like NBA champion Tony Parker just adds to the excitement for this massive event. Keep your eyes on all the Rainbow Six Siege social accounts for more updates. We're not done just yet with Rainbow. A new season is starting tonight. So let's see what the team has planned. Uh, Rainbow got Hi, new season? I'm Leroy, creative director on Rainbow Six creative Siege. Director. The Rainbow Six World Cup is going to be exciting and bringing the best players from countries all over the world in summer 2021. But for now, let's focus on what is happening in the game right now. A couple of years ago, we made the commitment to be live for at least 10 years. And today, we are already close to the halfway point of this symbolic milestone. We are not only maintaining this commitment, but we are doubling down by investing more than ever to make the game grow and evolve. This season will be Siege's biggest one to date. Biggest and we're excited one. to bring a familiar face to the Rainbow Six Operator roster permanently. permanently. Sam Fisher, our call sign zero in Siege, is bringing his combat experience and training into the game. You have to we are a huge fan of Sam, and we wanted to show you how he fits within our universe. Check this out. Yeah, they're bringing it permanently, so that's uh, Ubisoft keep going with that. 
Grind with the bucket like Mardu, man. How's that stuff work on our oh shit, getting the steroids? The nanobots should help. Yo, is that Splinter but you'll stuff? Pay for it tomorrow. Splinter stuff? That sounds fair to me. Is Splinter stuff? Hey, is it Splinter stuff? Here's to whip us into shape. Getting steroids, that though. True? Let's find out. Move out, people! Okay, I'm kind of conf kind of confused. Right? Is, is this for Rainbow or the uh, Splinter? I think it's Splinter cell. Or is this Siege? Like, they should have added subtitles. Nah, this is. I think this is Rainbow. New operator video. This is hard one. This is Siege. I once noted Apple for R6 anime. That's new operator, right? Comic Siege, Siege. How many of you guys play Siege though? One if you do, two if you don't. Oryx! Oryx! With your seed breath gun! Yerda! Yeah, Siege, she is Spanish. How did the first lesson go? You might want to call a medic. R&D is set up for, for first CSGO, a lot of ones. Same time tomorrow? That's the deal. Yeah, I gotta get into it too. Splendid. Anything else I can do for you, Sam? Yeah. Call me Zero. I'm a, I'm a CSGO nub. Operation Shadow Legacy. Available the new season now. is live right now. And we're excited to get your feedback on Zero and the rest of features coming out. Before I go, we also wanted to share some more good news for our players. Yeah, As I agree you know, with that, Nero. This year is I special, think it's because since the PS5 and the Xbox Series X are coming Xbox, out. Xbox, Today, Xbox, Xbox, Xbox. we want to announce that we are going to bring you the best Siege experience on console in 2020, with up to 4K and 120 4K. FPS by oh, the end of the year. Yo, and best of all, not current around. console players will all get this update for free once they upgrade to the next-gen platform of the same family. As we said, we're in this for the long run, and we have plans for years to Dave come. Dave, I see you talking Thank shit. You. I, I see you talking shit, Dave. Now it's time for a sneak peek at another fan favorite making its return. The heavy accent. I love the accent. Fuck it, my friend. Fuck it. All right, let's check it out. But yeah, I think the reason they have like those cartoonish animations is because that saved them a lot of money. I see you talking shit, Dave. I see you, man. Hey, hola, hey. Okay, so now uh, to, yeah, you saw the front of of the beloved game. Yeah, to be honest, games like that were so fun when you were a kid, man. I miss that shit, man. But at the end of the day, like, imagine buying RTX 3090 and having games like that. Goddamn, bro. And if you guys played games like that in your childhood, they were fun, man. They were fun. Like, not gonna lie, but it's just like. But I'm pretty sure the stud muffins and the chats. They don't wanna play these games anymore, man. Get out, get out. Nah, I love you too, day fun. I love you too, man. Solid two pian, like, don't do it, man. PS4 avail available holiday 2020. Oh, it's gonna be on Stadia too. It's time to check in on the dystopian police state of future London. Oh, you do not bring Music the Popo is back. a huge bro. cultural touchstone, and when you're working on a game that's set in a real place, it's something that you have to focus really hard on to make sure you get it right. Uh, when we asked Londoners who was an artist who would really reflect and, and Yo, underscore the themes brother. of Washington's Legion, uh, you know, speaking up for the oppressed and holding those in power accountable. There was one name that came up over and over again. This guy went from, you know, freestyling in the London underground music scene to headlining at Glastonbury in less than five years. He's had massive critical and commercial success. He's been on the cover those. of Time magazine. He's won dozens of awards. Um, and he really has used his voice to speak up and fight for social and political change. Yo, you were so forward, it's your worst. Oh, we got a rapper. I'm proud of wanting to announce that I'm a part of Watch Dogs Legion. You lot are about to have your minds blown. What they have done blown. in terms of recreating on the block. is the most insane, epic, incredible thing I've ever seen. 
So I'm honored to be a part of it. You guys are about to get an exclusive sneak peek of some behind the scenes footage and also of my brand new music video, Rainfall, which is going to be a part of it. Man on the block. Me and my manager got a wicked relationship with <laughs> the excitement. You said man. <laughs> I hadn't heard since I got booked for Glass though. Because I was like, yo, bro, there's this game. I'm getting my boys. Man, man got a good voice though. Yeah, man got good, good ones. Yo, that was a nice transition, dog. The green screen. Put my shades on. Put the up Yo, that's copyrighted. That's probably gonna copyright. He's gonna claim all the moon money, man. Kind of chill. Yeah, he got that clean voice. So I, I like the voice. Man, man on the block. Look out for the storm is following my enemy's mission in game on October 29th. October 29th. Oh, London. Our beautiful city has been through the ringer. New trailer. Now it's fallen into the hands of criminal organizations vying to control whatever's left. It's all gone to shit. Lucky for us, our underground hacker collective Deadsec is here to build a resistance. But where yeah, do we watch start? Yeah, might be good, boys. Look around. Hipsters, I think I'm punks, carpet. football fans, construction workers, paramedics, annoying tourists, grandparents. What do they all have in common? Any one of them could become your next playable hero. Oh, God damn, bro. And help you save the city. Yo, this reminds me of... Yo, this Let's is literally cool, like. Shall we? Well, this one looks promising. Let's hack into his profile. Ah, oh, Dan, a getaway driver. He has a completely custom vehicle to make for a fast exit. Oscars? And ooh, an anti-chase ability, making this him immune to those pesky GTA chase drones. This is not a carrying guard, man. He can Yo, also I'm hack a, vehicles to clear the way. That will come in handy in hot pursuit. Well, let's see him in action. Graphics are good as well, not bad. Or how about Eleanor? A hacker could always be useful. Thanks to her viral hacking skill, her w hacks or propagate, was... affecting everything in the surrounding area. She also can electrify enemies with her shock hack and can steal access keys without needing to enter an enemy location. Yeah, GTS seems wide, right? But I like the wife, I like the wife. You like that? Epic. Jordan, Feeling you like a that? a little more artsy in your approach? Teresa is a street artist. Her paintball gun gives her a non-lethal way to take out enemies, and she has paint bombs that can disorient them. Yeah, good wives. Like, nah, I'm loving the game. It's looking better than before. Not bad, eh? So how do you convince the people of London to join your team? Talk to them and find out what it takes to prove that your cause is worthy. Tell me what's wrong. I witnessed Albion doing some peak shit. These Clan Kelly guys, they've gone too bloody far. My friend's gone missing. Don't worry. Let's have we'll find them. After you help them, they will join your ranks and become the stars of your story. Yeah, she got the mama kick, bro. As you explore London, keep a lookout. Some of the most legendary recruits are not someone you just run into every day. Like this robotic beekeeper, Shelby. L W. She can wreak havoc using her bee swarm. What, what's up with these She UK also games? has a unique weapon, I personally the overcharge. Never. Her suit gives her shock immunity, so she can take more damage from certain attacks. I think for for me personally, UK setting is unique because I I don't remember any game that had a UK setting that I played in the longest. Yeah, I have never you played can any game old bloody city that has been set in the UK. Doesn't mean you should. Henry here's got low mobility, so he's not really fit for a mission that requires you to be nimble. And Mark, he's a hitman. Seems like the perfect recruit, but if you're approaching a stealth mission, maybe you should keep an eye out for another hitman whose attributes don't include hiccups. 
No matter who you recruit, you can specialise each individual to complement your playstyle by choosing one of the many unlockable weapons so and gadgets options. like the missile drone, the AR, oh, that's a cop. the that's spider a bot. Yes, I did say spider bot. I'm this just hoping the game team. is not repetitive. Make it the way you like. Recruit skillful people adapted for various types of missions, or go with weirdos and grannies. <laughs> no one's grannies. here to judge. So get out in the streets and assemble your dream team. Yo, that looked good, man. That looked good. It's cool. Yeah, it's better than last time. It's better than last time. Last time, I mean, I always, I was 50-50, but looking nice. Looking nice, sir. I am nice. the live producer on Watch Dogs Legion. On behalf of the entire dev team, I want to send a huge thank you to all the fans for the love and support since our announcement. I'm just and hoping today, it's not repetitive. I'm happy to yeah, announce that that's an old friend good. is coming back. You guys like this shit? Smash like if you like it. Back. Easy to say. Hard to do. Game looks like Cyberpunk. Uh, it looks, I just want the but less needs. like futuristic, right? Are you and it's ready hacking, for so. me? Hacking game. London. Aiden Pierce. Oh damn! So he was. I believe he was in you the asked, first one, no? And he's back. Older, but not necessarily wiser. Aiden Pierce will be a fully playable character in Watch Dogs Legion. Yo, that's a as W. Part of our post -launch plan. I played the first one. Found him. Check them out. The first game was repetitive, so I remember all. quitting. The We're game? gonna open up a whole new chapter Never played in this story Watch Dogs as part of our standalone DLC included. He was in the in first one, yeah. Stay tuned and welcome to the Resistance. Yeah, game looks Everyone promising. has a good reason to join the Resistance in Watch Dogs Legion. The fight for freedom begins on October 29th. Larry looks Ubisoft like a PS5 will be PS4 back game in the upgraded months, at all. More of everything you it was made for the PS4, but they're gonna upgrade but before it we go, too, I think. Here's one more thing. They want money, so they put them in. Of course, they, they want money, but I mean, they're doing it for the fans, but they're doing it for the mula as well. Oh, good shit. Can I have a bicycle? Okay. I'm down. I like games like that. You know, it's kind of like Skate 4 is as well. Without the skating movement, but uh, you know what? But... All right, CGI looking good, but I want that gameplay. You know, I want, I want that gameplay because I'm in trust in that. You be stop making a comeback, dog. They're making a comeback. This was two months ago. Be a be the good bit. Now they're live right now, dude. They're live. They're live right now. I'm sure this was pre-recorded, but like, uh, this is live. Riders Republic. So it's not too much old. This is live right now. Uh, Riders Republic. Yeah, I don't remember having. My name is Charlotte. I work in Ubisoft NSC and I'm a senior community developer. Today I'm very excited to announce Skate our five. new you guys IT like that Riders or Republic. Not? I'm digging the. I'm Riders digging this Republic type of game. is a mass Seems multiplayer fun, game where you enjoy extreme sports outdoors. Together with your friends. Yeah, really, and yeah Fall Guys, exactly. Realistic Fall Guys. Our studio is known for its expertise on many multiplayer games. And there is a huge word to explore. If you played Fall so Guys, I think you'll like excited. it. If you love Fall Guys, you'll like it. for me is about just killing it on dream terrain with the sickest extreme sports and doing it with other people. For Riders Republic, you enter into this world with all these people around you, which gives you a ton of possibilities to group up with them, to challenge them, to experiment with different extreme sports on different types of terrain. You have forest, you have snow, you have sand, you have mountains, you have cliffs. It's, it's amazing when you see all these people just flying around you, jumping off of jumps, jumping through gates. It's just, it's, it's one yeah, of those games, visions that you're like, play. oh my God, this game's you. crazy. Zero. But I'm intrigued, I'm interested now. Next gen social interaction game with a huge world and uh, a lot of possibilities. It's literally an extreme sports fantasy land. Our objective was to really depict natural places, and uh, we wanted to go for uh, the biggest, the most impressive natural places in the world. So we decided to go to the U.S. national parks. What we did is actually stitching together seven regions in a way that feels natural. But for each of them, we actually used GPS data so that yeah, everything sure you see scripted, stands for there sure for real. Is. And I think it's going to be a great experience. 
and or that's philosophy not a bad was thing to be is, able dude. to welcome different kinds of player, uh, let them enjoy the game the way they want, uh, choose their setting, choose their sport, and let them go uh, where they want to go. We're yeah, very excited like to be game, able man. to like reveal that. it like to that. the world. Like Fall Guys. So now I've got one more thing for you to check out. Enjoy it. All right, we're gonna oh, see. All right, <laughs> they just dropped the trailer. <laughs> Gameplay for next moment of gen. glory awaits. God damn it! Engine, how do you work this features. piece of junk? We'll be it'll dependent like on the platforms. <laughs> all right, please. Welcome to Riders Republic, adrenaline junkies. There are no rules here, but what's a republic without a constitution? Am I right? Here's a few truths about how we lay it down. We, the riders, welcome all thrill seekers to the Republic. Got that Fortnite going on though. Proponents of madness, get ready for radness. We, the got riders, that salute it, the rationality of irrationality. Yeah, I like that kind of. We, the though. riders, say that friends who slay together Colors stay are nice. together. Gather your best friends and go quick, Dave. And if you're digging it, would you what do you like the, the, the look of the game? Yeah or no? Yes or no? I smell microtransactions. Well goddamn my guy, goddamn. If you ride, the Republic will abide. The game seems fun, man. Go like we got dolphins and shit, dog. Banger or gay? I like the look of it, dude. I like the look we of the it. Riders insist that you I want you Ubisoft to F up so we can have memes, outrace, but this looks nice. Out trick, out perform. And gain some cred by sharing the magic with the rest of the Republic. Article 3, so... We the Riders so claim the right to bear the best gear. Boys, Needs more female bikes, represented? Bikes are yeah, I agree Whatever with that. Bakes your cake. I agree with that. What's up, Ape Thoughts? How are you doing? Freestyle, How's Nancy? Slope style, enduro, or downhill. As you grow, the drip gets so slick, and it'll help oh you drop the cliff. You got Red Bull. We the riders assure epic events to build your rep. Welcome to X Games. Yeah, you broke your back Sign on bikes and shit. You must like this game, right? Ape Thoughts. competition. You must like the Make game. Make a name for yourself. We never stop doing things for the first time. Red Bull Rampage, the harshest and most unforgiving canvas for big mountain free riders. Yeah, this is it Pots out here driving the bikes and said, Here goes my man. And bam, son! Look at my man go. It dots! It dots! Nah, dude, I dig the game. I dig the game. How much is this for PS5? Probably $70. Okay. They need the moolah. Money, my friend. Money. They need the $10. Actually. Nah, dude, it looks nice. Looks nice. I want them to, uh, to F up once again so we can have memes. We, the riders, invite you to leave the roads and take the trails. Explore the land. Climb the peaks. Roam the natural world. After all, actually, let's go. I agree. The mountains waiting. This like Prowls HD meet Fall Guys. Yo, dude, I love Fall Guys. Fall Guys fun. It's so casual, I like it. But some people try hard in that. Goddamn. But this seems exactly like it. Same formula, but with bikes and shit. Graphic looks nice. The colors are nicer as well. Yeah, I like it, man. Me and stuff. Me and stuff. Now let's wait for the microtransactions. Let's wait for that $70 price tag. And bam, bro. Let, hoping that. We the riders guarantee a ton of insane contests all the time. There's trick battles to grind your way through. Yo, you can stop making a comeback. I want them to F up, man, so we can laugh at the dog. Like, yeah, yeah, I want them to F up now. I hope the next game is bad, bro, so we can laugh at the dog. This is good. I like it, man. I, I cannot say anything bad Enjoy about this game, guys. I, I do apologize. Like, I wanna, I wanna play this game. <laughs> but this is good. I, I dig it. I dig it. Yeah! 
Reach that finish line first, Ryder. Yeah, Fall Guys formula right there. This shit's good, man. Wow, dude. Yeah, like Ubisoft were the employees were asking for Bob's and Magana's pick and they still made that game? Like, you know, Ubisoft is the new hotspot for asking for Bob's and Magana's pick. They made a good game, man. Dude's got a horn, I'll have to steal that. <laughs> dude, I know you've been stealing shit, but no worries, man. Like, hey, it's like I'm not gonna cover it. Dude, buy it, it's fun, man. Be on the lookout uh, for hold more on a updates on. Dude, on Amazon, it's like $13. It took me like three months to get it. Uh, three weeks, not three months, because it's coming from China. China number one, so. Uh, right. Like, it's so good, man. Just get it. It's good for memes. Portal's Phoenix Rising. Like, buy now, bro. Buy now. It's gonna Persia, take some time. Sansa Time Remake. Yeah, Got Prince to fight of Persia off had seven evil exes and, and Scott material. Pilgrim versus the world, the game. And witness the big reveal of Riders Republic. Along with so much more. Man on the block. You can expect more reveals and news in the next Ubisoft Forward. Be sure to stay tuned for the post show. I really didn't Featuring know that was going to Dude, I've been saying that for the Roller I'm, Champions show match. I don't know, like, I got it from somebody on Twitter. Yeah, I got it from somebody on Twitter, too. All right, we got another game coming up. Hello, everybody, and welcome <laughs> to the Ubisoft Forward post show. I'm Mimi, community developer oh, Mimi, of Mimi, Mimi, hey, Mimi. Rising. We know you've got oh, a lot in of Quebec. questions Damn, dude. for us, so reach out on social channels, and I'm gonna tell you about it Mimi. in a moment. But first, let's jump into the game in an area dedicated to the Alright, guys, I think the they're gonna up. We're gonna bring the memes out. Metal work and invention. This is the land of Ephaestus. Yo, meet your lock local e-girls. Mm. Local. Uh, uh, what, what's the tagline? I forgot the tagline. I'm bad, bro. Uh, you, you got single, local singles? Oh, the following in-game 4K capture has been edited for the time, Hello, my friends. My name is Scott Phillips, game director on Immortals Phoenix Rising. Today, I'm incredibly excited to show Imagine you Imagine having 3090 and playing that. Game. Immortals Phoenix Rising is an open-world action-adventure game with a fresh, stylized look and feel. Don't worry, fans, the gamer is it? No It's a tale of the gods to told by the gods themselves. On this epic journey, you'll play as Phoenix, fully customizable. Oh damn! Homie got Greek shot warrior. in the six. Jeremy According Harper got prophecy, shot by eight thoughts Phoenix on the Phoenix is the only one who can save the Greek gods from Typhon, the deadliest Titan of them all. To do this, Phoenix will explore the Golden Isle. I'll try to improve on this. It's just, it's just jokes. It's just the. Today it's just jokes, man. You might be living under a rock, or you might not catch the drift, but it's fine, man. His assistance in the I'll try to improve. I got you. Maybe Far Cry 6 will be out for this. This is Far Cry 6 gameplay. Look at that. Look at look at Two how good that looks. Two paths to relighting the forge of Hephaestus lie before us. We could challenge a Minotaur and his friends to unblock the air vents. This is Far Cry 6 for the PS2, my Or G. reignite the hearths of the forge. Both will lead us to face a legendary automaton. Let's go to the forge. All right, you guys want to see the forge? Before God of we the start forge. our adventure, Look we'll at use hug. Farsight to scout the journey ahead. This, this hut is cleaner than Call of Let's Duty Black Ops there. gameplay, I'll say that much, man. During her journey, Phoenix will reclaim legendary pieces of equipment, such as the wings of Daedalus seen here. These wings allow Phoenix to soar through the Graphics the air. are really nice. Your flying companion, Phosphorus, will join Phoenix on her adventures wow, as well. Man. More on that later. Here's a nice opportunity to gather some ingredients. We'll use them for potions later. Yeah, this is Far Cry 6 gameplay on the PS2, ladies and gentlemen. In Immortals Phoenix Rising, combat is an acrobatic, airborne, over-the-top mythological experience. With her powers, Phoenix Looks just like Breath of the Wild, brand new Far Cry 6. I think there might be. I don't know if they said that in the description. I'm check. Choice. Phoenix wields three legendary Maybe after weapons, this? but her ultimate weapons are her godly ability. Surely they gotta have something big at the end, because this one is... <laughs> okay, yeah, come on, now Ubisoft. I was asking for a feel, but not, like, epic feel like that, dog. We got a one-eyed big mother effer here, dropping rocks. Yeah, Nibba just threw a rock there. Nibba's in serious, man. 
smashing the ground is also This does not look attacks. good at all, Stud Muffins. He's looking like a Stud Donut out Let's here. Let's take man. a health potion. Yeah, it's, just to be safe. It's not Meme, though. Like, we need, we need a fail, but not like an epic fail. Knocked out. <laughs> we need something, man. We need something. Stunning enemies provides an opportunity to get in a lot of gotta dope to regenerate price, bro. stamina. Now we'll finish the fight with Hephaestus' hammer. Uncharted is Ubisoft, but nah, Uncharted is not Ubisoft. When enemies are defeated, how you feel about the, the how you feel about this frame? Gear. Dude, uh, now that the Watch Dogs done, looking nice. Can make our way that the bicycle rail. game looks nice. Rings yeah, I'm the team. Very the, veil to the, underworld the Prince of, of Persia was good too. Typhon's like they had realm. Easter eggs and ramen and whatnot. Like the uh, ramen order was looking like a snack. It was looking logic pretty fire. And, so, like, and are also a place to combine your abilities and combat skills solve puzzles and navigate your surroundings i like the combat Across dozens of vaults will face a huge variety of challenges where you'll need to mix and match your weapons and skills to overcome them you gotta be watching uh randy savage match like, like ooh, yeah, yeah. to be like it thoughts and get Using all the holes, legendary man. power Phoenix that's a secret upgrade her stamina. yo this is so beautiful man that music Look at that man. Acquired Zeus Lightning. This is like literally God of War, man. Like God of War, but lie in each or vault. PS, Uncover them PS1. To the rift. They had Zeus earlier too, and Zeus, Zeus was looking like a stud the donut, Nile, man. Typhon's they have to have Zeus in the game, bro. Corner. New Quest fans, Southwest. And as we all know, where there are enemies, there's loot. Gliding with the wings of Daedalus is always a joy, but we need to keep an eye on how much stamina we're using. Since flying harpies can be a challenge to reach, flying we can use the bracers of Heracles to pull ourselves toward them to start the fight. Did he say Oops. harpies? Phoenix needs to be careful with her stamina here. Potion will do the trick. They might have Far Cry 6 after this one. And now I on don't to know. The next one. We'll see though. Yeah, Watch Dogs was pretty nice. Is this like the Cyclops, Minotaur is also loving the environment to attack Phoenix. <laughs> but with Heracles' bracers, we can grab them yeah, they and throw them stop, right man. back. Game oh, looking. Anybody, we'll any of you guys gonna buy this shit, man? Or slash you with his claws. Just play God of War, man. Perfect Just play God of War. will grant Phoenix some precious extra time. But I guess Ouch. that if you're a parent charge and you're looking hard. for a game for your kids, I think, yeah, it makes sense. But dude, when I was a kid, dude, when I was a kid, With a few more perfect dodges, I would like my God of War and quick shit, attacks. That shit was let's fire, this fight man, on the, the help PS2. Of our companion, Phosphorus, I would take a parent with me. I would take a friend with me because they needed to check the IDs. Some of them did, some of them didn't. They would lock the games behind Let's like cages because it said mature, you know. The golden isle is filled with epic scale puzzles inspired by Greek mythology. Each trial will require you to discover, oh understand, God, and then solve bro. the challenge. These trials are okay, found I want to fail, but not this bad, just waiting man. to be found. When completed, you'll earn coins Nintendo of Charon to be used Godfall? in upgrading Phoenix's this, skills. Yeah, this and is PS5 gameplay, boys. Imagine. Buying 3090 and buying a game. Any Prince of Saudi Arabia in my chat that are gonna buy 30, 3090? Test, let's move on to the next I'm personally part gonna be quest. buying it, so there's that, but uh, I might get the first 3090. Step to relighting the forge is to destroy some of the corruption that Typhon has spread over the Golden Isle. Typhon. That horse. Look at that horse. You eat that horse, you get so much protein, bro. With the Buying corruption destroyed, golden we can PS5 use for this game. strength to grab some My coal fan. and put it in spending the Spending $500 to on console toy is a crime? Exactly, bro, like... Like, spending... Uh, that that golden 24k PS5 that this went on a pre-order cost, like, 8,000 8, pounds, bro. Only a prince of Dubai can buy that shit, dog. Like, I don't know, man. Any princes around... Any prince a around... legendary automaton awaits us at the forge, let's head to our base of operations for some upgrades. Nigerian prince? Yeah, exactly, dude. If you're a Nigerian, <laughs> Nigerian prince, dude, you this gotta... This is the Hall of the Gods. It is you where gotta Phoenix buy that will shit. reunite the gods to defeat Typhon. 
All of Phoenix's progression and customization takes place in this central. Hopefully, hub. Far Cry Six after At this. At the River Styx Cistern, we'll spend coins of Charon I know to it's upgrade lame, man. the Faceless Hammer ability. Trying to perfect for the fight to come. Play this so you guys got a dopamine spike and whatnot, because this this is putting me to sleep right now, man. Tossed a coin. Hammered it. On her journey to defeat Typhon, Phoenix will need all of the upgrades she can get. Punches it. She's ready to fight eight pots. Squatting. Oh yeah. Building them kicks. Getting those biceps flying up like a. Yeah, looking like a snake. With our new Ooh, ability, the model looking like restocked a potions and increased health and stamina, we're ready for this final fight. This game needs all the upgrades it can get. Yeah, any, any and all for sure. Built by the boss Hephaestus, doesn't even look scary, corrupted bro. by like, Typhon. Oh, this dude. automaton can unleash lasers on Phoenix. He's uh, he's, he's out there. Yo, that's I, I played God of War. Off, it right. had moments Let's like that. Let's use an attack potion. This is God of War. Copy and weapons face. and abilities. Preparing the rest of the fight. Athena's dash and Ares's wrath are all good Athena, choices. Athena, yeah, Greek, yeah. The automaton's uppercut is quite deadly. But this <laughs> quite deadly. Yep, right yep. Out. It's quite deadly, guys. Quite deadly. You guys want me to raise the volume? I think the volume is low, kind of. Call of Duty Black Ops Remastered. Let's finish him off with our newly acquired ability. Yeah, I love you too, Alert. If you guys are new, I do Call of Duty, all the gaming news on the channel, and PS5, history. Xbox, shit like that. If you're new, subscribe. Your name will pop up on the streams. Because next stream is going to be for Xbox Series X, and then we're going to get the PS5 stream, so I'll be streaming that. So definitely turn notifications on. Your Power name will pop up on the streams. The and maybe we're going to get Far Cry 6 gameplay after this. After this, I should say. Hephaestus' workshop is roaring maybe. back to life. Okay, big maybe. Phoenix's big job maybe. is done. Take a shot every time he says it's uh, God of War. Now, you'll be drunk, don't plans. do it. We're seeing Typhon's rage, which means he sent a corrupted fallen hero to try to do Phoenix it, my down. friend. Yo, thank you for subscribing, Andrew Media. What's up, my bet? This walkthrough was just a preview of the amazing journey Phoenix will experience in Immortals Phoenix Rising. This was just a walkthrough, more trials, guys. Just a preview. More larger than life monsters and more adventures. Larger than life line. monsters. Thank you for watching. See you December 3rd. December 3rd, 2020, PS5, Xbox Series X, and RTX 3090 gameplay, boys. Yeah, look look at Zeus, man. They made him look like a stud donut, not a stud muffin. Looking like a stud donut. Why are you saying Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Remastered? Uh, one day that will happen. I do have faith. Yeah, Far Cry 6, maybe. I don't know. Your book. Immortal Spanks Rising. Major, major. And you got HBR too, guys. Now, December 3rd may seem like a long way off. You got HDR too, guys. We've got a forget. lot to share with you between now and then. And now that you've gotten a look at the game, we want to know what you think. So join the fun on socials. Once again, I'm Mimi. And this Mimi. is Immortals Phoenix Rising. Now, Ubisoft Forward Post Show continues. Thank you for subscribing. Brother Champion, what you got? What you got? Hey, fellow champions. For the past few months, Yo, the Roller Champions dev team has been working on the games with groups of players from different skill sets. It just so happens that sometimes we witness some pretty impressive plays in these workshops. And so, for your eyes Far only, Here's one of the nail-biting match that we had, commented by one of its participants himself, Grant Haynes, also known as Fickle Platypus. We hope you enjoy it. Hello uh, and welcome, well, skaters. My name is Fickle, and today we'll be going over some gameplay footage provided by the private workshops in which we will be showcasing some of the newest moves coming to Roller Champions. Before we get the show started special? today, we'd like to give a special shout-out to all the players providing the footage today. We have myself, my two teammates, B and Razor, and we also have the opposing team, Poppy Kev, Via Trip, and Trash. So strap in those skates, sit down, and enjoy the show. Razor, and we also have... Now as we get started today, we will be showcasing the Mayan Stadium over in the magnificent Chichen Itza Arena. Get ready for thrills, chills, and spills! It's all... So if you've never seen Roller Champions before, it's a game about speed, high action, and... 
16 play. Oh, that looked nice, man. So take notice of those goal markers there as they light up on the screen there, because that's where the ball is going to be starting off on the kickoff. And as we get started, mobile game looking I'm actually going to use an extended tackle here to get the ball a little bit first in front of my opponents, just to get a little bit of leg up there. I can actually Yo, dive for twice to brother. jump in front of my opponents. I'm kind of used yeah, to when I'm on nice, the ground, bro. but thankfully looks my nice. teammates are there Reminds to take me the for me. That game, and you know, we get the started, cars and orange and razor are off to a quick start here, already collecting the one. It reminds me of that. to the two marker, backtracking instead of going the normal way, something you'd see in the high yeah, level kinda, pretty, pretty like commonly. Kind of like the same color palette. a nice challenge there from Trash. Is he going to take the ball from Razor? Yeah, Rocket League, exactly. Yo, possession. I, yeah, Can exactly. Collect the Rocket one? That's, this is where all the laps start. They do have to start over back at the one, so no matter where yeah, you Yeah, same pick formula, it up, but if different. You change possessions, you always have to restart your lap back over. So keep that in mind as we watch the gameplay here. And via trip, yeah, pretty much uncontested good. here coming into the four Gotta lap. Be to play, just man. Put a quick shot over on the orange team. Orange team not able to block that. And I believe that was a razor on the net. So good awareness here from Trip to see the open net and just take the shot. Banger or gay, you guys? Banger or yeah, gay? It looks like Razor almost got to it, but he was a little bit out of position on the back side of the net instead of the front side, trying to use that new uppercut mechanic to get a quick block in. One of the newest features to be added, no which far makes cry blocking rip, bro. and really gaining speed without the ball much, much easier than previous editions. Here we go. Orange team down by one, but it's pretty early in the match. The game lasts about seven minutes in regulation. So if a team is leading at the end of regulation, they will score there. Poppy Could Kev be with the uppercut, and it looks like Pickle is actually going to take the Post challenge show? there. That's it's a five. On the ball. Hot crash. Could be better. It's over really? the razor just to get it's it out right? of the It's all right. It's all right. Danger it's zone. Not bad. A little bit of a mishap there, and it's kind of a jump ball situation for the blue team. Poppy Kev gets it up there. You'll see that Poppy. uppercut used a lot, Poppy which is Kev. the Poppy tackle Kev. Poppy motion Poppy into Kev. a jumping motion. Just propels you straight up into the air like some kind of a jumping beam. Very, very useful on pretty much every point of the game. The game seems fun though. Like I, I don't know. Like I'm kind of on the ball. Pretty standard here. When you hear me Both talk less, not really that able means to get that anything started in the last like 45 I'm seconds. But nice impressive. interception there from Trip, and he actually gets the first marker there with the interception, using the extended tackle to grab it and then jumping over one. But Fickle's all over that, and that seems to be kind of a mosh pit here in the yeah, ball area. Half a mob, dude. Half a mob. For the start of the match, you'll see a lot of challenges happen in that one-two goal marker area. Should be Here's fun some separation here. Looks like Razor's got a ton of space. Really, no one in front of him. No one behind him. Razor, you got Ooh, this. And a critical error there, as he's gonna make a mistake by using that air emote to gain a little bit of speed. But ball, thankfully, nothing happens there. Huge tackle there from Poppy Kev as he uses one of the newest mechanics to be added in the game. It's the Best jumping air tackle, it, in which you jump, kind of do a spin kick, and be able to knock out anybody Yo, that's, that's trying to jump over you. You'll see that mind game used quite a bit here in this match. And with that tackle from Kev, Blue's looking for possession here. Nice quick pass over to Poppy Kev. Taking a little bit of time here to slow down the paces. Dodges out Razor. Ooh, look at this, a double block from the orange team on the net. So Poppy Kev's no, not gonna it, have any dude. of that. He's get just it, gonna Tiger. keep going, using the space provided. But here comes me from the backside. You didn't see that one coming, yeah, Kev, did you? Him up, I boosted yeah, off of B using the grapple mechanic and then the extended tackle thereafter get that extra bit of distance on Kev. Definitely caught him off guard there. Here we got Beaver nice out bit here. of team play from us on the orange team. Poppy Kev. Back to Poppy Kev. Poppy Kev. This guy, man, not very flashy, but he knows how to make the space he's provided. Just staying in the bottom of the bowl here. Really not gaining all that much speed, but really, if nobody's challenging, you don't have got to. The steam, the here he comes. Goals open here. Does he take the shot? B is dodge him, dodge him, dodge him. Nobody challenging in there. B gets the extended tackle on Poppy Kev and gets denied. Mm, Ball denied. gets ripped out of his hands and taken by a razor. And here comes the counter attack from Orange. Myself. Yeah, rolling it up to myself. Watchdogs and that skate. Nice game. mechanics Not there. Skate, I but, kind of you know, slowly side, pitched up the wall game. just to gain a lot of speed there using the uppercut and grabbing it at the same time. Something you'll see a lot of the high level players doing with that new uppercut mechanic. Yeah, that uppercut mechanic. Unfortunately, I did get wow. tackled there by Trip. Mind blown, dude. possession. Got a little bit greedy there holding on for too long. That's why you got yeah, teammates. Don't get folks. greedy. Don't get greedy. Poppy Kev. Poppy. Jumping over one. Poppy Kev. Up on top of the hips there, moves down to the bottom. This is Poppy Kev's zone here. The path the least resistance, and the goal is wide open here. Puts his armor for the shot. I actually get baited to jump, and Poppy Kev goes for the easy goal oh, he on the back side. He did Classic it. Classic shooting there from Kev. I got baited, folks. There's, there's really nothing to say else there. The arm goes up. I instantly jump to try to block that shot that's coming. Poppy Kev holds on to it and just goes backside. Yo, good the shit. goal goes both ways, folks, so you can shoot on either side of Poppy it. Poppy Kev. Poppy Kev making making work. Plays. Yo, thank you for subscribing. Welcome on in. The blue team. So they're up by two. Is now a Dude, the horn arrived the in the mail yesterday, Guido. It did. 
on top of the ball here. Welcome, Bob Emotes, Emotes, you but you kind of missed the nice whole show, man. There. Look at this speed but it's here fine, from these. So we had some mamies. We had some good games. Running off number two. Ball's a little bit flat here on that transfer, and Kev is just going to smother him as he lands. Pretty unfortunate there for B. Almost had a good run there. If he was able to put it out first defender, he probably could have made it I the don't give a shit lane. about sports game. Eh, that's fine, dude. Uh, Kev, We're the party gets subscribed for the yeah. guy on the ball. Nice tackle there from B. Pretty simple from the backside. Just going to pick it up. I, I find myself on the ball. B's open on the bull side. Ooh, just barely passed over to Razor before he barely. got air tackled. Nice there. Razor, backtracking once again. Seems on, to be Razor. a favorite of his. He's found, himself, he's found himself in space one more time, but again, it's the air emote. The timing on that to be able to double jump on the wall is very precise, and if you mess it up, you guys will like the, the ball. Like the game? Nah, yeah, or yeah, or yeah, yeah, yeah. Razor has found himself I think it can be fun. It's game. like Rocket League. Hopefully, you can pick it up later. But skaters. Passing over Kev. Nice read Poppy by myself. Kev. I'm shadowing Kev there on Poppy the pass Kev, I, I don't to make know sure I can focus. cover him I don't think it's just focused. in case that option focus. is open. You'll see that shadowing defense happen a lot for these high-level players. They don't, they don't really all aggress on one player. They'll spread out and really cover the entire they field. Be so two he towards one. Seems like a high-level tanker. Downfield. Here we go. Razor already collecting it. three goals here. It's open. He's actually not going to go for it because this is a three-goal potential here for the Orange team. If you collect two laps, guys, it will open up more points to be scored when you He's shoot a it. High level so thinker. they can complete this. This will be a three-goal game. Razor with a wide open straight here. This is a wide open shot, folks. Wide he puts open. it up. No, it goes crossbar oh, down. I, it's so wide open. I pick it up on the backside, jumping to shoot it. Oh Both, my God. Ball goes in and it's denied by Trash using the uppercut mechanic to pick it up from the mechanic. jaws of being in the net. I cannot believe that. It goes out multiple times for the orange team and Crash Trip game. robs them. And he's going to take that interception in denial. Run it back, potentially for another goal here. Shot goes up, and that goes in. Oh, yo, we have, yeah, yeah, yeah. They got gangbang. He's blocking all the nets. They got gangbang. Getting all the laps and shooting up. Yeah, the other team got gangbang. Razor tried to block it, but he was just a little bit misaligned there underneath. Yes, the I've just been postponed. Nah, you're joking. Good awareness again there from Trip to shoot. Okay, early. I'm gonna check it. Okay, I'm gonna check it. Just because I know you for a bit. You might not be capping. It's dire straits here for the Orange team. 45 seconds remaining. If they don't put three goals up here, at least to tie it, they're going to lose. Capping. So this is, this is do or die here for us. Yo, hold on a second. Timeout. Your timeout. So Battleful Twitter account was gone, and now I think it's back. And they dropped this uh, an hour ago. Hold on a second. Battleful 3. I'm up. I'm up. I'm up. I'm fucked up, but I'm up. Yeah, their Twitter account was gone, and now the, the captions are using I'm up. Battlefield 3 was, yo, Battlefield 3 was, uh, what'd you guys make of this? So their Twitter account was taken down, and now they uploaded this? Hey, Superman! I'm up! I'm up! I'm up! I'm fucked up, but I'm up! Yeah, I'm after, but I'm up. Basically referring to the fact that their Twitter account, yeah, it might not mean anything. Might just mean maybe, the, yeah, the Twitter account was sent to Twitter heaven, though. Like, their Twitter account got Ebola, you know what I mean? Maybe it was a... Somebody, somebody messed up, you know. There needs to be an investigation. There needs to be an investigation. Like, I, I think they're now back. Uh, might mean a new Battlefield game is coming up, but that's next year, so I don't think that means a whole lot. But, all right, boys. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you all so much for coming on. This is the after show, and uh, this game looks nice, but some of you guys say it's trash, so it's trash, whatever. Uh, Watch Dogs and this... That uh, that bicycle game was pretty nice. Other other than that, that there's not... Yo, Prince of Persia was pretty good, though. It had like wifey, it had that wifey material character model, so that was pretty nice as well. I like that shit, man. But, anyways, guys, thank you all for uh, stopping by. Catch you guys on the next one. Like if you enjoyed it, dislike if you didn't. Uh, subscribe if you're new. Next stream must, uh, next stream should be for Xbox. I think the Xbox stream will be next week, uh, and I'm probably gonna stream that. So, next stream Xbox, then I think PS5. Sony is gonna reveal the PS5 price and they're gonna do their stream. So I got you guys covered with all of that shit. Yo, Hyper, thank you for subscribing. And uh, I'll see you guys uh, in the next one. Yo, thank you for subscribing as well. El Cocky. Appreciate subscribing. Welcome on in. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. All right, peace out.